Yeah, whoa. Hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> Hi, Ellie. Hi, Milkata. Hi, Rudolph. Hello. 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 Hopefully, the uh, game sounds are fine. My HSR is running. You know what's running really hard? My PC. He's really running super, super hard. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hi, guys. So, uh, fortunately, um, my dinner arrived uh, before I could uh, fully envision a small sheep as like... As like a miniature suckling pig. Uh -huh. <clears throat> yeah, but we won't talk about that uh, anymore. <laughs> Miniature suckling pig. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah, so... We're snacking today! Yeah, I'm having a candy right now. I have some snacks uh, beside me as well. So, uh... Things are good, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm still kind of like, um... Just waiting... Waiting for someone to realize who, who my... Um, which character it is I have that I'm not supposed to have, but alright. I got popcorn. I ran out of barbecue corn, guys. We ran out. That's the saddest thing ever. We ran out of barbecue corn. <laughs> we ran out of barbecue corn. How am I supposed to live like this? Also, hello, Ergelin. Hello. Hi, hi. Um, this is fine. We're all fine. Everything is fine. We're all fine. We got this, people. Passing away, Kiko! No pass away! No pass away. I guess you're impatient. You also want... You... You probably also want everyone to find out who the baby is. But like, oh well. <laughs> Please don't pass away, Kiko. Don't pass away, okay? Don't pass away. I still need you for like this Wednesday, okay? You have to stay alive to Wednesday. Kiko! <laughs> Also, hey, hey, pretty ladies talking to us, guys. Hey there. Didn't we already meet before? You should loosen up a bit. The place is quiet, but that's okay. We can talk whatever we want here. Oh, I'll talk to you all day, baby. I mean, a uh, what? Yeah, anyway. Is small sheep still alive? Did your conversation with Gallagher last time go well? He might look like he doesn't care about anything, but he actually has a lot on his mind. Otherwise, he wouldn't be a regular here. No, Kiko, four hours of sleep! Oh. <laughs> That's like... <laughs> Please sleep a bit more, Kiko. I, I am aware my stream timings don't make that... um. Uh, don't make that uh, easier for you, but nonetheless, you still have to sleep. If you have to sleep, you have to sleep. Also, hi, Chewy. Hello. Um, yeah. She's our fave lesbian NPC. She, I don't know if she's lesbian, but damn, does she like radiate at least bi vibes? Oh my god, yes. My place offers nothing but joy. Let's cut to the chase. Oh, I see you like to be straightforward. It's good to keep things simple, but you might get on people's nerves for being too direct. I'm kidding. I like how pragmatic you are. <laughs> it is our event more important than sleep. What fates it? What event are you trying to rush this one to? <laughs> Alright, you seem more relaxed now. I invited you here because I needed your help. Oh my gosh, I... I mean... It, it, it's after all just... just uh, Yeah, it, it's like mean of me to say this, okay? But like, to me, I'm just like... Uh, I don't see the benefit of rushing there. Especially since you guys know how tiny that place is, but... Hopefully, um, the next event is much better. Yeah, hopefully. Hi, Tuya! Okay, so back to Siopan. Very interested in the art of mixing drinks, especially after seeing how well Gallagher does it. Something unexpected has come up and I need to be away for a while. I'm looking for someone to take my place temporarily. I think you've got the talent to ace the job. What do you say? Why me? Why me? I just go with my gut. Must I have a reason for that? Come on and try it. Don't be nervous. I'll guide you step by step. 
Let's make drinks, baby. Let's make drinks. Because since you're just starting out, follow these steps first. Oh, okay. Let's choose a mini wine glass first. Okay, mini wine glass. Bubsy daisy. Glasses have different volumes, and that determines the number of ingredient portions that can fit inside. Okay. Let us continue to the next mixing steps. Okay. Follow the steps and add a large amount of ice cubes. Um. More ice. That's not a lot. Okay, I guess it is a lot. <clears throat> but it's fine. I got Tan Hung. Let's go. Anything for my husband. Okay, anything for Tan Hung. Alright. Please don't forget your other husbands, Kiko. Each drink has three flavors. Sweetness, intensity, and thickness. Okay. Sweetness, intensity, and thickness. Alright. Let's add the step. Let's follow the steps and add a portion of practitioner pepper first. Okay, so we need sweetness. You can see the drink's sweetness and thickness have changed. Ooh, okay. This is the flavor tag resulting from the change in sweetness. Ah, okay. Now add a portion of ice so glad. Stirring will mix the ingredients in the glass together, which can change the drink's appearance. Okay. Ooh. If you made a mistake, you can empty the glass here. Alright. The next the basic moves are now done. Next, follow the steps and complete the drink. Okay. Soothing soda. Ooh, baby, it looks beautiful. Okay, we got it. Select origami bird. Oh, this is pretty. Look at all of these. They're so nice. Pepeshi Fofo! You can add a Pepeshi Fofo! Oh no! So cute! Let's go! <gasps> Alright, Gummy Bird! Yay! We are done! Woo! <gasps> Ine! Ine! So pretty! It's so pretty! Wow! Hi, Martian. Uh, I'm not pulling for any other characters. I already got Locha. Mm. Let's see... We're getting the hang of things already. Technique wise, you're a pass. It's only because you teach well. Just to be clear, flattery will get you nowhere. It does make my mood better though. It got us somewhere, hey. Knowing the mixing technique is the prerequisite to becoming a drinksmith. However, it takes more than that to serve drinks that impress your guests. Okay? The most crucial skill that a good drinksmith needs is listening. Drink smithing is all about having conversation with your conversations with your guests. Drinks are magical. A beautiful glass of liquid, a cozy ambiance, and a little bit of conversational skills are all you need to make someone open up. This might sound a bit esoteric, but I believe you have the knack for it. I can tell you're someone with empathy. Not only that, but you can also read someone's mind and even regulate their emotions. <gasps> How did you know? You found my power! I've learned to pick things up from my experience here. Being able to understand the guests is a must for every drink smith. I saw you having a good time talking to Amiki last time. I know her well. She can be clingy, and it's not easy to convince her to leave without making a fuss. So, I believe you're the right fit for the job. What do you say? I'll take your signs as a yes. I can't disagree. I mean, I want to do it, but... If you aren't into mixing drinks in the least bit, what made you come here? I don't know, the mission? I guess? Your overflowing sentiments? <laughs> Since you've decided to learn from me, there's no backing out now. Just chill out and make yourself at home here. Free Jade? Yes, Fate. Free Jade's brought me here. Yeah. We cooking. Yeah. At this lounge, we don't serve the guests or Dream Chaser. Dream Chaser in Pentaconi. But the monsters staying in the hotel in the dreamscape. They used to be members of the Sweet Dreams troupe that served the family. As you should know, the dreamscape is collapsing. The negative emotions have altered the temperament of the troupe members, turning them into uncontrollable monsters. I stay here to help them stabilize their emotions and restore them to their original form, which can be a long process. If the issue isn't resolved, they'll revert to the frenzied state, which is the last thing I want to see. 
please take care of the monsters when I'm not around. So there's a catch. Since your job scope is more or less the same, it doesn't count as fraud, does it? She's sly. Well, those monsters aren't aggressive, so they won't hurt you. It's just that their personalities can be a little abrasive, so you need to be more patient. You can find details about their conditions in this troubleshooter. Feel free to flip through it and jot down stuff in it. The troubleshooter, okay. Let's see. These are the customers you need to serve. Yes, they're all members of the Dream Jolt troop. Their respective emotional troubles are recorded here, okay? You'll need to chat and make drinks for the monsters and gain their trust that way, okay? After gaining their complete trust, you'll be able to obtain an item to access their inner world, okay? The introductions are basically done. Let us continue our earlier conversation. Okay. Making drinks for the monsters to gain their trust and help with their emotional troubles is the job of a drinksmith at Dream Jolt Hostelry. Host, 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 ah. That makes me a counselor. If there's a cool bartender like her, I'll sacrifice my kidney just to keep drinking a cocktail. You can always order the non-alcoholic stuff, you know? You know, she doesn't make just alcoholic stuff. She also makes like non-alcoholic stuff. <laughs> you can put it that way. The chance to have an in-depth conver to have in-depth conversations with monsters doesn't come by every day. Consider it a perk. Actually, your job is pretty much the same. To listen to the needs of the monsters and provide suitable drinks for them. Try talking to them as much as possible. They really hate to be lonely. Do you remember what I said just now? Drinks are magical things that can make someone open up. What a drink smith can achieve is so much more than you might expect. Now, I'll leave the Dream Jolt Hostelry under your care. Hostelry? Hostel yeah. Okay, let's be... I, I. Okay, uh, we got it. No longer Daniel. I am drunk in love for her. Oh, same. Uh, wait, she reminds me of King from KOF. Who's King of KOF? Let's see. Don't panic. You have to get used to speaking to customers one-on-one -on -one like this. I'll speak one-on-one -on -one with you any day, pretty lady. Hey, I'm sorry. I mean, what? The mission is to resolve the monster's emotional troubles. You'll be able to see their... You'll be able to see your progress here. Finish serving your customers to earn tips that the monsters leave you. The tips you earn can be exchanged for rewards here. Don't forget. There's a customer already waiting. Quickly, start serving them now. Okay. The ingredients are all on the lounge, the whole range. Feel free to use them. I won't charge you. That's wonderful. Hmm. What YQ? Okay, I think I think you guys are on a tangent. King of Fighter, character that's a bartender. Oh. Okay, I learned something new today. Thank you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'll pay you based on your workload. If the customers are happy, the pay will satisfy you for sure. Yes, Jades, please. I'll be watching things from over there. Take it easy and dive into your work. Okay, let's go. Spade. Hey, uh, let's take a look at this new drinksmith. Let me guess. You owe Stiopan some money, which is how he got roped into working here. That must be it. I knew it. Stiopan looks soft-spoken and treats people so gently. She's quite a talker. Whenever she's on the street, people always ask if she wants to become a celebrity, but she's definitely a devil in disguise. Be straight with me. How much do you owe her? Let's see. Hey, can I help you with that? Even with your help, I still might not be able to pay you back. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You didn't really think I was going to help you pay off your debt. I was saying, I know a place where you can strike it rich. In the back of the hotel in the dreamscape, <laughs> there's a monster that looks like an alarm clock and enjoys having people tell it off. So you could go over and spit a few sentences at it. Maybe they'll put it in a good mood and then it'll give you all its money. Oh my gosh. So there's 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 a monster that's into that's into being berated? Oh my gosh. 
He's into... Oh my, I see. So they're into that, huh? So we gotta, so we gotta find a monster that's into being scolded. By a handsome guy. Or pretty lady, whatever. I don't think they're picky uh, at this rate. Okay. Hmm. Remember, you can't say that I was the one who told you. Hehehe. <laughs> okay, okay. Now be a good drink smith and put in an order for me. Let's get the bitter ones. Let me think. I think... I want that. That, that, last twilight. I remember seeing this drink on the drink menu. Let's start preparing the drink, baby. Okay, uh, last twilight. The customer's orders are here. Look for the correct drink according to their requests. Okay, last twilight. There we go. Excuse me. Lost twilight, very bitter, very mellow. Hiding in the crowd of the night under the pretense of joy among the surrounding revelry. Start mixing! So like the large wine glass. Big wine glass, guys. Okay, big wine glass. Next. So like the more ice. Many ice, guys. Many, many ice. Okay, then we have a soothing soda. Wait. Then we have a red sunset sauce. Hi. Oh wow, this is so bright. Okay, let's stir. Oh my gosh, pretty. And then we add another red sunset sauce. Uh hi, wow, sexy, okay. Next. Oh, only after the glass is full. Oh, I need two. Okay, sorry. I I screwed up, okay. One soothing soda. Two soothing soda. And then we have one red sunset sauce. Then we stir. And then one more red sunset sauce. And then uh, we go next. Select the robin cart. Ah, pretty! Then we complete the mix. Ooh. It's so pretty. Oh my god, you know that the way they pan is like, ah, so pretty. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The color of the drink suits me so well. Look at how deep and profound I am. So deep that I'm flying. What was I saying? Oh, the hotel in the dreamscape is not safe. Xiaopan doesn't let us go too far, but just between us, I saw lots of people over there a few days ago. They were all wearing something like black suits. They wanted to arrest me when they saw me. I was so shocked I got teary-eyed. And in the end, guess what? They don't even dare to step foot in here. <laughs> I stood inside and started wildly mocking them. They were so mad that smoke was coming out of their ears. All they could do was walk away with their tail between their legs. Their tails between their legs. Pretty interesting, right? I'm a little thirsty. Bring me another super intense drink. Uh, one that reminds me of the joys of playing tricks on them. Okay, super intense. This time, the customer didn't order a specific drink. They just mentioned the flavor that they want to try. You can check the flavor tag for each drink here. Let's see if it matches the customer's request. The filter function here can help you quickly find a drink that meets the requirements. Oh, okay. Uh... Okay, so very intense means very strong. Okay, we got very strong. Oh, we have this. Um, Metropolitan Rome. Uh, this is pretty. And we have this as well. Clockwise sleep talk. Ooh. They're both nice. They're both nice. Which one should I... Should I make? This is pretty. This is prettier. I'll go with this one. Okay, so like the mini vintage glass for the nest. No ice. Okay, so we're not putting ice. We need to put the ultimate setup. It's pink! And then one ice so glad. Oh yeah. Okay, next. And then next we put the intelligent ornament. But that was easy. Hey, okay. Very intense flavors. Let's go. This monster loves strong drink, huh? Honestly, I would get a strong drink too. This is very pretty. Ooh, it's so nice. Look at them. It's it's like my favorite color. I love it. The origami bird looks adorable. It's so cute. It's like a tiny borb. Ah. 
You did a good job! Drinking this is like I can feel the bitter emotions of those people in black suits. It's like... You're going home crying to your mother. <laughs> With all that said, I feel way more comfortable. I guess even a bad drinksmith is still a drinksmith who can spare you a word or two. I think I've had enough. I'm off. Take care of yourself, newbie. Don't let that seal pun eat you alive. Hi, Shadow Pill. Hello. Hope you're feeling better. Hey, just our tour redeem is still there. Quick new chatter still. No, 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 no after serving it once, Spade's trust in you has increased. Okay, let's see the results of this session. Receive and serve customers to get tips. If you satisfy the request, you will earn more tips. Oh, Very nice. <gasps> it's a doggo! It's doggo! Ha! Doggo, 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 doggo. Mr. Bigway. Woof! Hello, new drink smith. I'm Soda Dog. Just the sight of me will bring people joy. Uh, you bring me joy when I look forward to what, what drops you have. I mean, um, what? I mean, what? Who's your pun? A banging lady. She's a banging lady. She'll pay us. Well, yeah. You look pretty tired. Is there anything I can help with? Can you help make drinks for me? Lol! Woof! I'd love to help you, but I'm just a dog. There's nothing I can do. Can you help me wash the cups? Oof, I'd love to help you, but I'm just a dog. There's nothing I can do. Can you help me clean the tables? Oof, I'd love to... <laughs> it's just the same thing! Is this dog trying to rile me up on purpose? You're getting angry, aren't you? You're getting angry, angry! Oof, but you're the drink smith for this lounge, so even if you're mad, you still gotta make me a drink. Isn't that right? You're too kind. Thank you. Listen up. I want a refreshing drink, please, Wolf. Pretty please, Wolf. Okay. Is there an option to toss the dog out? Let's just start preparing to drink. Ugh. <laughs> okay, refreshing. Let's see. We got something that is all the flushing. Okay, it's just this, I guess. <clears throat> Let's go. We need the super-sized vintage glass. Mm hmm Less ice. So not a lot of ice. The ice is pretty! Hi, Luna. It's so warm. It's warm, but today is already better than most days, I think. It's already better than most days. Okay, so we need Dream Jam. This is a lot. And a one. And a two. And a three. And a one. And a two. Ooh, look at this baby. It's so pretty. Let's go. Next. Okay, so like a clocky card. Clocky card! A. We are done! Ine, oh my gosh, I wish I could make some nice drinks for myself. Oh, that would be great. I could use a nice cool drink right now. I love this drink, Wolf! Newbie, you're on top of the pack when it comes to serving customers. Woof, I still have a question, Woof. Um, with so many fun places out there, why did you come here to be a drinksmith? Because I accepted your pun's assignment? Ah, uh, I mean... Looks similar to something I'm drinking. Oh, is that so? That's wonderful. I shower about three minutes, sweat again. You take three minutes to sweat? I sweat right out of the shower. That's a, that's a weak game you got right there, Luna. Woof! Spending your time and energy to satisfy other people's demands. You're working a job! If you're just here working a job, you shouldn't use the title of Drinksmith. Fancy title isn't going to cover your essence. I've almost reached the limit of my endurance. Uh, you're a bigger pain than that spade. Oh! I'm pretty easygoing. If you don't get along with me, maybe the problem lies with you. Oh, shut up. What about yourself, Wolf? I 
Where's the drink, Smith? Making harsh comments about your customers is rude and inappropriate. I don't want to discuss this with you anymore. You resort to blocking me when you can't win. Even the tolerant soda doggo can't do anything about an unreasonable person like yourself. Oh my god, you piece of... Woof! There's nothing much to say. Better just continue drinking. I want a slightly sweet drink. Can you do it? Please get it out of here! Ah! Oh, it's a cold shower. Ah, I see. That's wonderful. Slightly sweet. Let's see. Slightly sweet. So we got these two. Fine. I'll give. I'll give it like a very nice. Ah, uh, fine. Need one glass next. Then we got the more ice next. A uh, practitioner pepper. I so glad. Stir one soothing soda. And then, um, we'll just add the origami board. Complete. That soda dog is so annoying! Ah, oh, thanks for the hydrate. Cool, cool. Mm. I have hydrated. Delicious drink! A flavor I like! You really know how to make me happy! I'm feeling a bit dizzy. It's so nice talking to you. I'll come hang out with you some other day. Be sure to welcome me with open arms. I am the soda dog that brings happiness to everyone. Goodbye. Everyone except me, I guess. This dog is really infuriating. <laughs> Record information, I guess. Wait, let me just like get a nice screenshot of this. I think I can use it. Um, Record information. Don't get <laughs> this is pretending to be kind and passionate, but it's actually trying to make you angry. Don't get tricked by its appearance. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, so we got we managed to do it well. I'm about to blow a fuse already just after serving two customers. Is everything going alright? I feel like teaching them a lesson. It's normal to feel that way in the beginning. Please don't take it to heart. They're just too affected by the nightmare that they can be a bit twisted. When things were all good in the past, they were a bunch of lovely and sensible kids. I really appreciate your hard work. Uh, I haven't done much. Uh, okay, hydrate. Thank you. Hydrate. Done. I'm already grateful because you can accept these monsters and treat them as equals. Hmm, it's time to give you the advanced lesson. A creative mind is key to mixing drinks. You need to come up with special blends based on the time and your customer's preferences. After I show you the ropes about free mixing, you'll be able to craft drinks that aren't on the menu. This is something every drink smith has to learn. Things could get boring if you keep dishing out the same recipes. Oh boy. For instance, I want a large extra sweet drink that brings back happy memories of my past. Nothing on the menu fits the requirements. What should you do now? Don't panic. Let me show you what to do. Okay, so large. So basically, uh, most of the time customers will have customized requests for drinks. Okay, so pick like a large glass. Now you can fulfill the request, okay? The step where the customer doesn't make a request will be your time to shine. Uh... No ice? Less ice? No ice? Less ice? Less ice? Uh, less ice? No ice? Less ice? Uh, no ice. Let's go with no ice. Um... Okay, the other request is extra sweet. Let us review the rules of mixing drinks. If it's a super sweet drink, the sweetness measurement must at least reach 2. Practitioner pepper can increase a, drink, a drink's sweetness. Let's add one portion and see the results. Now add another portion of ice soul glad which also adds sweetness. Hi. Ah, the criteria are met. Now I'll leave the rest to you to fill up the glass. Oh, okay. Let's see, we can put in like... Ooh. 
This is pretty. Okay. Next. Then we can just go and we can put the... We can put the Peppa She Fluff Ball. Oh no, it's so cute. It's so cute. Oh, look at this baby. Oh, it's cute. I love this. I think the burp is cuter. Then you do it in your own... Then you do it in your own one. Just make your own drink and let the guests judge everything else. Ah, oh, it's pretty. Kawaii. So cute. Excellent. Your grasp of flavors is on point and you can accurately perceive what's on someone's mind. I might ask you to make a drink for me one day. I'll be gone for a while. But the monsters will still drop by from time to time. Please tend the lounge for me. Without the drinks here, I'm worried those monsters might get angsty. Now you must be drained after a long shift. Take a break. Dealing with these weirdos day in day out is, in in is indeed quite tiring. Being a drink smith is certainly no easy feat. Okay, so... Ooh. Go serve them, prepare for business. Are we ready? Let's go. As expected, Siopan is not around. Let's open for business. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Good night, Shadow Pelt. Hey, look at him. So handsome. Sorry. Time to figure out how to deduce the recipe for specific drinks. Okay. Let's see. We have this Ice Palace. We have uh, Begin Deduction. Deduction. Use the designated ingredients to mix the drink shown in the image. Oh, okay. Use specific ingredients to recreate the drink in the image. Okay, so we have... The glass selection and ice cube steps have been skipped for you. Okay. Alright, so we have probably this. I think it's this. Stir. Then... This and this, something like that. Next, we put the origami bird. Is it done? Oh, do we engineer it? Ah, pretty recipe successfully deduced. Yay! Very nice. Oh my gosh, we get jades! Yum, 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 delicious jades! Okay, now let's deduce this one. Uh, begin deduction. Okay, so we gotta do this. Um... Hmm. Stir and then put this practitioner pepper next. Put the sliced lemon. Is it done? The less you care, the more you appear cute. Hey. Yeah! We got this! We got this. Hey. Mmm, dates go brr. Begin deduction of this one. This should be easy. Yeah, this one's easy, Lamal. Let's go. Oh, I love it. It's pretty. I will order this. I will order this. Yay. Done. So, and that was already 38. Wow, stones. Okay. So let's what's the revenue statistics? Ooh wow. Oh damn. We can just uh, we'll submit these later, okay? Let's just um start with this right now. Oh Tin Man! Over there! I told you to make me a super thick drink in the small glass. You hear me? What are you looking at? 
you're gonna pass away on my... No, don't pass away on right home, Kiko. Ah. But yeah, get some rest. Uh, don't, uh, don't, 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 like, uh, sleep. Don't, don't, uh, right past your... <laughs> I suddenly can't English. Now, don't miss your stop. Yeah, don't miss your stop. Okay? Yeah, and then if you have energy, and only if you have energy, um, just get back, uh, into, into chat or something. Yeah? Yeah, but then... Sheep bartender arc. Yes, I I I I'm actually good at bartending, guys. We're doing this. Remember, I don't care who you think you are. As long as you're behind that dilapidated lounge and have those dirty glasses next to you, then you better listen to me and do what I want. I'm the one paying you. Got it? If you catch my drift, then hurry up and start mixing your drinks. Stop pretending like you're doing something. I don't need any reminders of that idiot. Rude customers like this really get my blood boiling. Start preparing the drink, let's go. You already learned free mixing. Of course, both methods can fulfill certain requirements. But this time, let's try using the free mixing method to fulfill the client's needs. Okay, small. We need a small glass. Small glass. Next. Very sick. Uh, means no ass. No ass, okay? <clears throat> so very thick we need like we need the big thick. We need to put the thick. Uh, let's see. Uh, why do we do this? Oh my gosh, this is so thick, man. This is so thick. Eat thick, baby. Eat so thick. Wait, let me try an experiment. Uh, like this. What if I do this? Stir. It looks kind of ugly. Oh god, that that that's so ugly. Uh, how about I try different ones? Let's try stirring this. You know, I like the tri-colored one better. Okay, I like the tri-colored one better, so let's just like... This... like this. We'll go with this. Looks like pudding. Yeah, it does look like pudding. Do you want super thick? I'll give you thick, okay? I'll give you thick. Uh, yeah, hamster ball night cart. This drink is perfect in a small glass. Too much can ruin the flavor. <laughs> this drink is really good. I gave it to him so thick. It's so thick. Haha, <laughs> that's what I want. Anyone smart enough to listen to basic orders will make a little bit of scratch at the very least. You, covering for Stepan? Can a fool like you come up with any interesting drinks? What a joke. I'm not kidding when I say I've been a patron of this lounge since it started. Back then, there weren't even proper tables. The counter was just thrown together and would fall apart if you put any weight on it. This place didn't even have the full range of ingredients. Even considering how awful the drinks were back then, the drink you made was just the worst. What killed me even more was... Even after I told you how I was a regular of this lounge, you still didn't show me respect. Is this how a server should act, huh? Listen here, you're new, so you better act like it. Be sure to bow, do your job right, and serve your customers. Be the humblest you can be. I'm here to buy happiness, so you should be making me feel special. Got it? It's pointless to tell you. Just give me a small glass. I want it sweet with clearly colored layers. I've got a great eye that's allergic to things that lack aesthetics. That's some strange aesthetics required regarding layers. Okay. Move the mixer first. Hurry up! I'm not here to watch you be flashy. Fine, you asshole. Yeah, let's just make it. Okay, and a small glass. Make it small. Next. We will have extra ice. More ice because I hate you. There we go. Uh, we, need we need sweet. So we're gonna have, uh, hmm. <laughs> it's just me. Uh, 
<laughs> and the board is hey. Oh shit, I forgot. Um here. Okay, so I need um Hmm. Pretty. Nice stir it. That's the ugliest shit I've ever seen. We're not doing that. Um. There. This one's pretty. This one's pretty, guys. This one's pretty. Okay. Let's see. Distinctive. Drink. Uh, fine, I'll give you like sir mint leaf. Oh, this is nice mint leaf. Let's go. Blue. This is pretty, isn't it, guys? It's so pretty. Yay. Very nice. Very sweet. Strong. Very refreshing. Ah, this is so pretty. I love it. Pull his moustache away from myself. He has a moustache. Oh my gosh. Tisk, you've got decent taste. I made my demands clear and now I can make some palatable stuff for you. That's all. I run down place with an awful drink smith and dumb monsters. Ha! Are you all hiding here playing house? What? What's the matter? Got something to say? Here's your chance. Spit it out. Poke it with the stir stick. Let's go. <laughs> Oh my god, we're gonna beat his ass! <laughs> Hi, Shari! Hello! Yes, pretty layers. They're so pretty, aren't they? I love it! Okay, take out the lance. Just you wait! We've got a lot of days ahead of us. Don't assume that Steelbun can protect you. Just you wait. Yeah, you're just scaring off. Quite the rude and arrogant monster. It is quite big, though. Mm-hmm, okay. Continue service. Let's continue. Ah, Spade is back! Hello! Shik shik! The dice roll as fate plays its tune. Dang, it's you again! <laughs> How much money do you owe? Did you sign a contract or a letter of guarantee that you're gonna work this lounge until it's back to its former glory? Listen here, just forget about it. Why not enjoy this time? Let's play dice. Come on, test your luck. Oh, I have sunglasses now. A. Thank you. Let's get started. Are you going big or small? Big or small? The dealer calls the shots and all bets are in. Lose and you've got to pay. Win and you don't. You should give me the, the pink color glasses, but like that's that's before you, you put this on, yeah. And you don't. Go big. You sure you want to choose big? Big, big, big. Oh, now that I think of it, I bet it's gonna be big. Because all the small numbers have been scratched off by me. They're not comfortable to sit on, always making me want to rush to the bathroom. Excuse me? So you're going big? Not gonna change? Speak now or forever hold your peace. Go big or go home. Yeah, I'm on the edge of my seat. Is it small or is it small? Oof. Crack! The dealer starts to tap dance for you, and the dice roll faster and faster, keeping in time with the performance. Just as your body catches the rhythm and starts to sway, the dance ends abruptly. You can see plain as day that each side of the dice has a single dot. It was small, just as I expected. <laughs> it's my fault. I put in too much force when digging into the dice. Looks like I made a pit instead. Ha ha ha! I'm sorry to say that you lost. But that's okay. I'm bored now. I'm feeling super worn out. Give me a drink, quick. I want that drink that's in a small glass and has a strong taste. A taste that rejuvenates my spirit instantly. Players, remember to replenish your electrolytes after exercise, okay? Seems like he's asking for us. I don't think I can fulfill this request in the drink menu. So we need to... I want... I want a small glass that tastes intense, okay? Next, we want something strong. 
Less ice. Less ice. Okay, no ice. You want strong? No ice. Okay, so we need the intensity. Uh... So we need something really strong, right? Uh, let's go with uh, strong. Well, you want strong, right? So only one. If I oh, you only want one. Okay, okay, got it. Uh. What if I stir this? Then we have just like... Hmm! Nice! Are they nice? Next, we shall put... Uh, a sliced lemon. Yeah, this is pretty. Let's go. Complete the mix. Complete the mix. Oh, it's so pretty. I love making pretty drinks, guys. Ah. I'm feeling so good and I'm flying. I want to feel this happy every day. Speaking of which, I just thought of something very sad again. I was once a good kid, you know. The kind who literally couldn't have gone small if he said he was going to go big. That was true up until... Until I was assigned to work at the hotel. The environment here is just the worst. The air is so stuffy and it won't even let me go to the bathroom when I want. You're suffocating me. Oh, I meant emotionally suffocating, and those people in black suits are always watching. They never give me time to rest. Before long, I found myself forgetting if I should toss big or small. To be honest, is the number really that important? Does it matter or not? Clearly the guests are the one playing, and yet you want me to cheat? Give me another drink. This time, I want a large glass. Bitter and super strong. Small or large, I'll drink them all. They're all the same. No problem. Large, huh? What style of glass should I choose? Okay, let's go with a big baby. Okay, she wants a big glass. You want a big glass? Big glass? Ooh, yummy. This is the big glass. Uh, let's see. We got the big glass. Um. Okay, and then we want... You want strong, so I'll give less ice. Okay, bitter, so it has to be... Soothing soda is kind of bitter. Mm. Okay, so we have this bitter, very strong. Can we stir this? Ooh, it's so pretty! Okay, strong. And then we have this, and... Can we add one more? No, no, this is, this is pretty solid. This is pretty solid, I like it. Uh, next, we shall put... Pepeshi? Robin, huh? Oh, this is a nice one. Robin, yay! We got a nice orange band around it. Ooh, yummy, yummy, yummy! Oh, it's so pretty. <gasps> I love it. Ah, the deeper the goblet, the truer the friendship. I love that you can understand me. <laughs> I'm off. I'll remember you, newbie drink smith. Hehe, <laughs> I feel so good I want to sing. If we stick together, we won't need to worry about the bad guys. We'll just back out and leave if the family is too powerful. There's no need to beg or worry. Better to be hungry than angry. I just heard a bunch of Spade's thoughts. I guess you must trust me more now. Yep, record. Okay, record the information. <gasps> we have a hundred percent. Thank you. Hey, very nice. 
The being disciplined harshly caused it to become the miscreant that it is now? Oh. Continuous service. Oh god. Woof! The soda doggo that brings happiness has returned to visit you! Oh no, it's this doggo again. What are you looking forward to seeing me? Are you happy? I was looking forward to this! I'm so happy! Thank you! But no matter how much you look forward to it, it's pointless! I don't care what you think in the slightest! <laughs> I will turn you... I will turn you into roast meat, you little shit. Oh, woof! I go wherever I please and say whatever I want. There's nothing anyone can do about me. I used to be like you, busily serving drinks to customers. If anyone says something to me, I'll just respond with, Roger, woof! But one day, I had this epiphany. A dog's life is also a life. Rather than let people shave off time from my life, I'll shave it off of theirs. Uh, okay. If you don't do anything, no one will notice you. All that matters is that you're happy. That kind of makes sense, I guess. Woof! You finally get it. But getting it is only the beginning. <gasps> Hi, Mel T! Hello! Milk delivery! Milk delivery! Yes, I have received the milk delivery. Thank you so much. Milky Mew! Hi, readers! Hello! You guys are playing Just Chatting. I think I saw you guys playing Honkai Star Rail just a bit before this. Did you guys change to Just Chatting? To kind of like... Um... Yeah, but either way, hope it all went well. Hope it all went well. Hi, Milky. How's the stream going? It's going well. I'm making drinks. Uh, doing all kinds of voice acting and hopefully um, everyone's entertained, you know? Excuse me. <clears throat> oh yeah, I was doing the event too. Just watch some memes before ending. <gasps> I see. Memes are always good. They're always universal and stuff like that. Yeah, this event is fun and they're giving so many jades. I just... It's like just from reconstructing the drinks, we got like 30 jades. That's like really strong. So... Yeah... Damn... Ah, oh, that's so good. <laughs> yeah, I hope you had fun. If you want to like uh, hang around, feel free to hang around. If not, go and rest or something. Oh, yeah. Okay, anyway. Hello, Raiders. I'm Yuri Shiba. I'm a Shiba VTuber. I'm still finding my footing in HSR and like doing... Um, doing HSR things, learning how to actually uh, play this game on stream so uh, i'm very grateful to people who have given me the time of day and then from time to time i also do interesting stuff like tarot readings the other day i was doing like a stream where it's like i'm just doing tarot readings for like the honkai star characters that was fun i intend to do more but yeah it's fun experimenting with content and things so 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 hey if you like that kind of stuff hopefully you can hang around for a bit longer but like yeah that's up to you hmm I'm gonna get food while they lurking at phone even then. Go get food. Food is so good. Yeah. Welcome to the sheepdom, all the newcomers. Love, love, love. Is that a dog of a soda hanging on his neck? Yes. I wouldn't have pulled for Archeron if they weren't giving out this many pulls. Y you can afford to pull for Archeron? I mean, I guess I could, but I just came back from pulling Locha. Uh, I don't know if I can afford uh, Archeron. I don't know. So, I haven't pulled for her yet, but who knows? I might change my mind, yeah. On a scale from 1 to yes, how relatable is this event so far? Yes. <laughs> I skipped Sparkle. Oh, I did not skip Sparkle because I have Imbibita Lune. And Imbibita Lune um, needs Sparkle, so yeah. How did the pool win? He may go ruin my pity! Ah! Mixed feelings because I mean I could eventually raise her to help me count to help me do pure fiction, but at the same time, oh my god, he may go not like this. Give me my pretty blonde abundance boy. Give it. Yeah, so anyway, he did come home. So he's part of my main team now. It is what it is. Okay, so let's make some drinks, guys. Let's make more drinks. I see you're pretty tired. Why not start practicing with me? Make me a large and strong drink and I'll teach you how to interact with people. Always trust her with good luck. I don't have good luck. Oh my god. I just... I, 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 at least Himeko is better than Yan Ting. Bill guess who has E1 Yan Ting? Guess who has E1 Yan Ting? 
Uh, definitely not Miri Shiba the Shiba VTuber. Definitely not. Uh, why why would I have Iwan Yanting? <laughs> we do not talk about that. Okay. Let's go mix. You want thick means not us. No, as is thick. Okay, we're gonna go so thick. We're gonna be so thick. Okay, thickerino. We want thick, 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 thick. Okay, but we only have one thick. You want one thick? Okay, so I guess if you wanna go thick. Oh, this is a bit hard. I need to math. He's E2 on yours. Oh god. Uh. Let's see... How do we do this? Minus one. What if I do this? Okay, so we got this, alright? And then we got like this. So what if we add like... Another one? We have to take away two. <laughs> We're doing math! We're doing math! <laughs> this is so ugly! This is so ugly, oh my god. Ow, this is so freaking ugly. Okay, we got purple and then we got like uh another one. Nice rainbow drink. So we got this and then uh we take away one, right? Uh Okay, you know what? I'll take this. I'll take this. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Wait a minute. I think I forgot something. I forgot something. Um. So we have this. Oh, we have this. And then we have to stir, right? Then if we want to add, say, a uh, pink. Like that, then I have to add this. Okay, we'll go with this. Fine, fine, we'll go with this. All right, all right, fine, fine. This is nice, this is nice. <laughs> hi, Vivian. Can I have a drink too? I want it sweet like you. Oh, hey. Oh, oh, oh my. Hi. <laughs> hey, I forgot what color it was. Hold on, let me see. I think I have like... Give me a moment. Let me let me mess with my model a bit. Oh yeah, see guys, I got the adventure in specs. Hey, 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 I got the adventure in specs, baby. Let's go. Hey, did the wrist work? M m m maybe <laughs> it's not like it's not like I care anything. Perfect. Or should I go pepeshi? Not really pepeshi here, but like. Mm. You know what? This is fine. This is fine. Look at this! Oh, let's go! It's pretty! Pretty! She's now needs some gun, but let's pull some banner. Oh yeah, offering to sponsor! Thank you very much! The flavor is amazing! From now on, you are the best drink smith in my heart! After drinking this, it's time to teach you how to talk. <laughs> Listen up. Hey, idiot dog. <laughs> you really want to teach someone with that pathetic brain of yours? Newbie, don't let this dog's appearance dupe you. That dog looks cute, but in reality, everything it has to say is unpleasant. When that dog was a courier, it got the highest number of negative reviews, making fun of customers, stealing soda, and pocketing tips. It's never done what's just what it's supposed to be on wagging the tail of it so happily. I figured it out. Good, I may be crazy, but I've never hurt anybody. I've known that dog for a long time. I've never heard anything good about it. 
Let me tell you, it's a selfish bad mouth dog. It's best if you keep your distance. Don't give yourself unnecessary headaches. Ah, welcome to the sheepdom, uh, Briti Br Br British cane. Okay. Woof! Mr. Dealer is often pulling things out of thin air and causing trouble wherever he goes. He's kind of off, you know? No one at the lounge likes him. Hey, who are you talking about? I heard everything you just said. If you're going to talk smack about me behind my back, I'll have to give you a hard time. And I'm having a private conversation with our dear Drinksmith here. Mind your business. Everything Mr. Dealer says is a lie, so don't mind him. He's not like me. I'll always wag my tail in a friendly way to you. That's the only thing I can do. I believe you. Thank you, you trust me with just a few wags of my tail. You're so easy to fool. Woof, delish. Hit me with another. I want something sweet, refreshing. Something along those lines. I get the sense that these two don't have a good relationship. Rest in pieces. Ah, small sheep is here. Hi, small sheep. He's here to drink water. Let's see. Sweet and refreshing. Okay, uh, sweet and refreshing. Why don't we try giving him a big ass... Um, big ass glass. Okay, let's go. More ice. Okay, sweet. And only flushing. Okay, sweet. Hmm. The sweet and refreshing. Okay. Mm. I gotta do math over here apparently. Intensity. Mm. Why if I stir? That's the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Holy shit. Uh Yeah, red sunset sauce. We gotta have that thick. Okay, we gotta stir. And then we got this so glad. We got the... We could have this. This is the weirdest looking drink I've ever had. What? This is so weird. This is so weird. Okay. Okay, we do this. And then we do this. And then we just do another one on top, I guess. <laughs> what is... Okay, uh... uh yeah, uh, uh, there we go. There we go. We, we, um... It's math, okay? We, we do the math. To each their own drink. Hey. <laughs> I guess it's pretty. It's two of my favorite colors. So it is what it is. Um... Woof! This tastes amazing! When Xiaoban's not around, you are the greatest drinksmith here. Woof! You really turned my mood around. But I wonder if I drank too much. I'm seeing lots of black spots. Over here! <laughs> Over here, good little doggy. Let's play. Come with me. I'll take you to your fun place. Woof! You wanna play with me? Wait for me! Uh, uh, uh I have a bad feeling about this. Spade took Mr. Bigwig out to play. I wonder if those two will cause trouble. Uh, hopefully not. Hopefully not. But I feel like I understand Mr. Bigwig more now listening to it. Okay, so we got like... So got delivery unit. It wanted attention. Okay, so it wanted attention. Nice. Okay. Eh? 
Why is there commotion? Oh no, are they fighting? I love this radio, woof! You broke it! I want you to pay for it! Oh, I'm sorry. And I didn't mean to break it. I just held it too tightly and crushed it by accident. <laughs> Are you going to cry? More, please. What happened? Woof! I lent my radio to the dealer out of kindness, but he smashed it on the ground. There was no smashing of any kind. To be more precise, I only pinched it and it shattered after I applied a little, a little pressure. How fragile. Whoa, 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 did you hear him? It wouldn't have happened if the radio was harder than the floor, would it? <laughs> You're clearly messing with me! I'll tear you into pieces, woof! No fighting! <laughs> I'm being framed, newcomer. You've got to help me out. Woof! I didn't do anything. It was all his fault. Neither of them admits to any wrongdoing. I should probably ask them separately. Oh god, let's just talk to them separately. Uh... It's not my fault! All I did was lend him the radio out of the kindness of my heart, and the next thing I knew, he smashed it! Wolf! You're the new drinksmith, you've got to help me! Was the radio important to you? Wolf, it's my precious treasure! Of course, it's important! And, and the radio represented an important memory for me. Xiumhan gave it to me. Xiopan hasn't been around lately. There's no one for me to play with. I'm so lonely. That's the only reason I wanted to play with the dealer. I made him angry on purpose because I wanted him to notice me. If I didn't do that, no one would pay attention to me. <laughs> At the very least, if I behave more badly, more selfish, I can be happy. At least you'll talk to me more. Maybe he's become so unbearable because no one is spending time with him. I should go into his internal world and see what's going on. Soothe its feelings. Okay, I'll the emo dial. Tick tock, tick tock. Are you ready? And enter the emo scape. Enter the emo scape. Let's go, baby. Oh, let's go. We can do this, right? Okay, let's go. Boom. Okay, let's just go. So we're supposed to go... Activate... Oh wait, there's this... There we go. I didn't see the extra plates. Like you go all of a sudden, hey, let's play. I feel so much better. Who knew having some company could be such a wonderful thing, Wolf? You gotta take me out to play again, okay? Wolf, Wolf, I wanna go play. I wanna go play. Will you intentionally make someone angry again? Wolf? I'll be the soul the doggo that brings you happiness, who's smart and nice. I'll be friendly and won't cause any trouble, Wolf. Play with me again sometime, Drinksmith. Aww, that's so cute. Aww. That's very cute. 
He just wanna play! He wanna play! Let's go. Okay, so we have uh, calmed him down. Let's calm Spade down. I I'm innocent. That radio just randomly started blurring out loud noise. I was startled and slipped. My grasp on the radio loosened and then it dropped. <laughs> I'm a victim too. Besides, it's just a radio. What's the big deal anyway? If he wants to listen to something, I'll give him something to listen to. I can talk about all kinds of stuff. Scary, funny, serious, or even the kind of stuff you can't put on the airwaves. Whoa now, I'm also quite the expert when it comes to canine jokes. Apologize. Are you serious? You want me, an innocent and passionate kid, to bow my head and apologize to that idiot pooch? I feel so wrong. Of course I know what I've done. I can tell the difference between right and wrong. To be honest with you, I did it on purpose. <laughs> And bring it on. Show me what's what. <laughs> I've been like this since the day I was born. Nobody can deal with me. Maybe if I can seize this chance to slip into his internal world and help him change this bad habit of pranking others. Yeah, I know, right? It's stupid ego. Let me drink. Okay, thank you for the hydrate, rabbit. I has been hydrated. Okay, is it another puzzle? Are we gonna beat people up? <laughs> if you don't just on there get bored, can't have all in the mess of someone. Oh god. <clears throat> gotcha, you fell for it. Oh no. Uh, how do we get this? Okay. Hmm. Should we go here first? Uh, oh, is this? Where is this? Which four star are you gonna pick? Oh wow. Uh, I don't know yet. He retrieved the bubble charge. Okay, we don't have anything here yet. Sorry, yeah, because I'm not there. Oh my god. I already have E2 Gallagher from um pulling locha, so I don't think I oh my god, seriously. Yeah, but Shiri, I don't have Shiri. I think I'm gonna get her, yeah. We should have like a mono thing thing. Here we do have this one here. Where are we gonna go? Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi there. Hi Ray Dolores. Hello. Welcome. Thank you for the raid. What were you guys doing? Probably playing Honkai Stario, right? Honkai Stario? Oh no! The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask! That sounds wonderful! I hope you had fun! 
I hope open world games are always such a pleasure to play. Hopefully, you had some great accomplishments. Hello, Raiders. I'm Yuri Shiba, Shiba VTuber. I love uh, Honkai Stario. I also love tarot reading. And uh, they, they kind of don't really relate to each other, but I'm here to have fun nonetheless. So hopefully, hopefully, we can find something we all enjoy. Yay! Welcome! Welcome! Thank you very much. Thank you! Thank you! Yay! Thank you, thank you. Yes! So hopefully you had a lot of fun. Alright, then if you like to um, go and rest, feel free to go and rest. If not, um, you can feel free to lurk around as well. So yeah. See you. Hmm. Let, let me go. I know I was wrong. I'm truly sorry. And I'll apologize to every dog around the world who has ever been bullied. From this moment on, I will be the protector of all dogs. I will make sure no dog ever cries and will do so until the day I die. I... I... You want me to teach you another lesson? I... <laughs> I actually... I didn't really do it on purpose. The, that wasn't it at all. It's just that... Well, Siobhan hasn't been around recently. I thought maybe... If I made a scene, she might come back. Siobhan would come rushing back if the monsters were in trouble. I'm sure of it. I did play HSR earlier in the day. How goes your HR adventures? I'm doing great, I think. I think? Uh, yeah, we're making drinks, solving problems and stuff, so... We're just grinding jades. Yeah, wonderful stuff. So that's why I smashed the idiot pooch's thing. You shouldn't have done that, right? I know. I know. From here on out, I'll be sure to not bother or make fun of the idiot pooch. Idiot pooch! See how hard that slap was? It hurt so much, I'll never forget. What if... You let me off this time? If this happens again, you'll get slapped ten times. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I've been miraculously revived! I'm a good boy! I'm putting my uninhibited nature behind me! It's all happy days from here! Everyone likes dice! Ha ha ha! Yeah. Yeah. That's perfect, baby! Any try Gatron? Do you have her already? Nope, I'm not intending to get her. That might change later. But like, oh my gosh, we got more drinks. Let's go. Yeah, um, that might change, but for now, I don't intend to get her. I don't know what kind of team I'll make with her anyway. Hey, eat it, put it, put it, 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 it. Oh my gosh. Love, you still have a pay me back for the radio you broke. Even if this lounge is big, you won't escape. Yeah, I, I I don't know what they're doing. Are they okay? Looks like they've patched things up. They've patched things up. Oh my god. That's wonderful. Hey, I'm back, Mary. Hey! Tomorrow short reset and here's our time for exchange. What fate you care about that? I thought I thought you were I thought you were far beyond that point of like watching for short resets, but okay, I guess I'm wrong. <laughs> Thank you, Raiden. Uh, go have a, go have a good rest. Okay, I'll see you some other time. What do you mean? I need those stuff too. Sure you do, Fate. Sure you do. Okay. How did you, how did it go? Uh, did you like being a drink smith while I was away? Oh, my mind can come up with our sad moments. You look pretty cute when you're sad. Oh, 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 I mean, I mean, if Siobhan, of all people, was calling me cute, I'm... Well, <laughs> so ter I mean, I'm... I mean... <laughs> what problems did you encounter? I'm all ears. Sharing is so important. It can double our blessings and cut our burdens in half. The drink of a work... The work of a drinksmith is all about listening and chatting. Let's go. So that's what happened. As the collapse of the dreamscape accelerates, the monster's emotions become increasingly unstable. Similar conflicts will only keep growing in number. Who knows, maybe we'll have a bigger headache to deal with later. But you did great. You're a bona fide drinksmith. Allow me to thank you on their behalf. This is this part of a drinksmith's gig, huh? As a drinksmith at Dream Jolt Hostelry, Handling the monsters as interpersonal relationships is all part of the job. Didn't I tell you right when you started? Being a drinksmith here isn't a walk in the park. Hi, Amuteddy, hello. Will you do something for me? 
Please make me a drink. You've been a drinksmith for so long that you've probably figured it out. If a customer is sitting across from you, that means they absolutely trust you. You can't come at this job with a 9 to 5 mentality. I can't wait to see what kind of drink you make me. Any requirements? This place is called Dream Jolt Whole Story because all the guests here are members of the Dream Jolt Troupe. You've seen the Sweet Dreams Troupe, right? Those billboards that run around the streets, the musical instruments that play automatically, and those surprisingly large eyes. In a dreamscape, objects with self-awareness like that are everywhere. All those monsters used to be part of the Sweet Dreams troupe. Hardworking, well-trained, and obedient to the family, providing amusement and service to the guests. Yeah, they were all good children. Until the nightmare struck and turned them into monsters. The form that you now see, insane and babbling. Is there a solution? The solution is what you're doing now. Making the right drinks, listening to your guests' thoughts, and calming them down. Before becoming a drinksmith, I used to be the administrator of the Sweet Dreams troupe. My title might have been their administrator, but I treated them like my own family. That's why it hurts me to see them in this state. So I decided to stay here, hoping that I could help them get a bit normal again. That they can regain recognition from the people and have happy lives. Drinksmith? Yeah, it's part of the event. But the process was too long. Ah, welcome to Sheep Dem Chashiro, welcome! Even with the monsters' emotional issues temporarily placated, the nightmares will still return time and time again with no end in sight. And I'm starting to... feel tired. Can we resolve this once and for all? Well, I'm getting a bit sleepy. That's all for now. I'll tell you more later when a chance arises. I have enough atmosphere to generate inspiration now. Please make me a drink that brings feelings of nostalgia in an extra large glass and is slightly sweet. Its taste should be particularly strong. Let's go! Ooh, this is... Ooh, my gosh. Customers will sometimes have requests for the beverage's flavor base, okay? To, re to create the flavor base, first prepare the required normal flavor, then... Give it some stirring. Ah, okay. Let's choose an extra large glass, okay? Click to proceed. Alright. Hi, I'm Dark Sheep now. Ooh, okay. Choose however ice cubes. Um, we're going with more ice. Let's start creating flavor base. Okay, slightly bitter. So we want um soothing soda. Okay, add some soothing soda. Add some red sunset. Oh, ooh. Okay, then stir. Shung, shung, shung. Ah, so this is the nostalgic one. Okay. Flavor base is done. Now add puffer goat milk. We got new ingredients. The flavor base created from stirring won't be influenced by subsequently added ingredients. Oh, okay, we got this. We saw we got puffer goat milk. Oh, oh, okay, all right. We got blossom dew as well. Uh, we need something strong. We could go for, um... Blossom Dew? Ooh, look at this! It's so beautiful! Fell blood. Dream Jam, maybe? Blossom Dew and... Unfortunately. Ah. <sighs> Unfortunately, we kind of like... Okay, we do the minus uh, soothing soda, and then we had the... Ooh, let's try this. Uh, stir. Ooh, we have this, okay. Okay, then we need...
puff goat milk. We need puff goat milk. I like the I like the one better. Hold on, I like this one. So we got like this, and then we had this. Stir. It was like this sexy purple. I remember. And then puffer goat milk, right? We have this. Very strong. So we just have to make sure it's at least two. Very strong. Uh... Yeah, let's go with this. Fine. We'll go with this. This is absolutely fine. It's pretty. It's pretty. Next, uh, let's go with uh, Pepe C. Pepe C. Nostalgia. Or should we go with this? I like the mint leaf. It gives a nice touch. Okay, let's go with the mint leaf. Mmm. It's like a sweet, strong, very thick, nostalgic. Mmm. Mmm. The flavor is okay, but it kind of kills the current vibe. Drinks, whether these taste great or terrible, Refle reflect your most genuine thoughts at this moment. How you understand the guest before you and how you intend to respond to their trust. This might seem simple, but so much more than that. Is that so? Oopsie. Oh, there's something else I need to tell you. Even though the family treats the Sweet Dreams troupe as mere props for the guests' entertainment, there are quite a few people who take a genuine interest in them. Some have even told me about it and become regulars at the lounge. If you're interested, you can also invite your trusted friend here. But isn't it the hotel and the dreamscape sealed off by the family? Just tell them you're my guest and the family's guards won't stop you. They're merely obedient bloodhounds following orders. Don't take them too seriously. That's all for now. You must be tired too. Get some rest. The road ahead is long and it will be tougher than you expect. Ooh, okay. After solving the issue between Spade and Mr. Bigwig, the two of them will probably get along peacefully at the lounge now, right? Xiaohan was once the administrator for the Sweet Dreams troupe. How unexpected. No wonder she has such a soft spot for monsters. Ooh, baby, let's go. Okay. Um. Do do do. What? Some customers who are into monsters <laughs> who are into monsters come in. Oh shit! And the lounge livens up. Siop Han hasn't shown up yet. Well, let's start serving customers anyway. Ah da 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 da. Ah, small shape is fed up. Hold on, let me just see if he wants to go out. Yes, baby, you wanna go out? Let's go, Daddy. Alright, off you go. Oh. Okay, small sheep wanted to leave. Oh, I didn't I didn't meet the request. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Wait, we can feed. Ooh, we can complete. Ah, eighty. Oh my gosh, that's so generous. Yay, eighty. Eighty. Oh my gosh. Let's go do recipe deduction. Let's go for glorious sour begin deduction. Hmm. Gold like that. Mm. Just stir everything. I guess so. Okay, so we have. Oh, 
What if we do this? Drink hint, okay. Oh, we need more eyes, okay. So two dream gem. Oh, okay. So we need two of it instead. We do this and then we stir. And then we did ah oh, okay I'm a bit of I'm a dumb I'm a bit dumb sorry yeah for the nice glorious hour dream gem fell blood yeah just for that ten amazing okay let's see use the designated drinks to ingredients to make the drink shown in the image um. Mm. Okay, we got this and then I think it's just this. Yeah, it's just these two. Next. We have the origami bird. This is quick. Done. Ooh, it's very bitter and strong. It's pretty, but it's bitter. I don't want it. I don't want something too bitter. Okay, Wintry Garden. This one looks interesting. It looks sweet. Let's let's see how we go about it. We need um okay, so we probably need red. Of a goat stir. Sorry, not that. Um, stir. Like that. Then syrup. Syrup. Is it like that? Oh, I think it is. Then we have the hamsters. Oh! The era of gentleness has become a distant memory. You see, very sweet, very strong, very thick. It looks sweet, it is! It is very sweet. I'll take this. I will cry, but like, it is what it is. Yay! Okay, so we've deduced, um, we have deduced this. Let's continue. Let's see, revenue statistics. Uh, Okay, let me submit the tip. <gasps> Yo, this is so much. Baby, I'll take it. I'll take this. I'll take everything. Ah, let's continue. Oh my gosh, I want this. I want this. This one's so pretty. This is so pretty. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Maybe I'll finally have materials to like raise my light cones. Let's go. Limited time rewards. Uh, uh, collect this. Collect revenue level 4. Hey, We are getting so much! What the hell? We've already reached like 4k jades. This is insane. Okay, let's continue and we begin the reception. Baby, let's go. Melancholy. Here comes the jade. That's right, here comes the jades, baby. You know, you exude an air of detachment, evoking a profound solitude as if you weren't really here. I don't know how to establish a connection with you. Your exceptional uniqueness makes me feel inferior. <sighs> Perhaps this place was never intended for me, yet for fleeting moments, I did experience a glimmer of warmth. My aloofness remains unaltered even in the face of defeat. And your hubris is irreparable beyond any hope of salvation. Ah, what's the point of talking about all this useless stuff all day? How about something tangible, like a glass of drifting wind? Don't forget to add that pretty decoration on it, thank you. What's the decoration of this for this drink again? We'll just start preparing it, okay? So we need a drifting wind, this one. 
Okay, so we need to get a large wine glass. Next, we've got more ice. Next, this one will be fast. Uh, odd concoction, soothing soda, soothing soda, iso clad. Okay, next. And then we have the mint leaf and we complete that. Let's go. A distinct bitterness just like my life. No, not like this. Don't be disrelatable. That's just rude. Ah. Okay. Heh, how capricious happiness can be, fleeting as the bubbles dancing upon my glass, it vanishes in the blink of an eye. Are you new here? Are you going to bully me? Where is your pun? Have you ousted her? Behold, within this spacious lounge, a seasoned drinksmith finds no place to dwell, much like this grand hotel within the dreamscape, where I struggle to find my niche. Oh, where shall my tender, melancholic soul find its abode? Yeah, I'm the successor of this lounge. I should just stop daydreaming and snap out of it. I should have known better that we don't deserve something so great. Ah, sure. Siopan is great at mixing drinks, but given their location, it's only natural that the lounge remains deserted and unattended. What's the point of being a drinksmith here? There are no customers, no revenue, much like those unwanted concert tickets. And when the curtains are raised, you step onto the stage, only to be faced with a mere handful of people in the audience. It's truly disheartening. Perhaps this lounge will go out of bins will go out of business soon. Why are you saying that? That's so rude. I don't know why, but it's just a feeling I have. I'm unable to see its future, and I struggle to accept its presence. Its present, sorry. Heh, might as well have a few more while I'm here. And give me a glass of something that exudes brokenness and is very refreshing. And add a decoration of Miss Robin to it. Thank you. Interesting. This is the first time I met a customer who cares so much about the decorations. Nice. Okay, so free mixing. Alright, so we need a flavor base. Okay, uh... Maybe we can go with something really large, I think. Okay, so we want... You want something strong, so maybe less ice? Okay, we want something slightly bitter. Slightly bitter minus one... Then you want something that is strong... What if I do this? Stir... Ooh, it's already very refreshing. Oh my gosh, it's so ugly. Sorry. Um... Something... Soothing soda... Mm. What about this one? That's ugly. This is just experimenting. Don't mind me. Soothing soda. Maybe we have uh, ultimate syrup. Stir. Mm, a sexy purple. Very nice. It's a broken base. So we want very refreshing, which means that it needs to be... Negative uh, 2, I guess. So we want something that is like... Blossom Dew... Negative... Uh, eh. This one maybe? Hmm, this is pretty! I like it! I like it! This one, this one is pretty. Okay, then next we have Miss Robin's ornament. There we go. This is pretty. Let's go. Ooh, very nice. This is pretty. I like it. I actually really like it. Let's wait for it to get a nice angle. Oh, yeah. No, I didn't get a nice angle. Never mind. Happiness is an elusive treasure, one that needs cherishing, but I drank it all in a single gulp. Ah, <sighs> 
following the bliss, boundless emptiness once more consumes me. It's time to leave the stage. Surely some of a life as fulfilling as yours won't even remember me. May we meet again where there is light. Melancholy is melancholic just like its name. Such a pessimistic personality. So we write stuff down. Okay, 50%. Let's go. Let's continue the service. Oh, lady. Hey, girl. Hello, there? My friend told me there's a new drinksmith here. That must be you, right? Hee <laughs> hee, just like I thought. You seem like a fascinating person to chat with. In that case, let me ask you a secret question. Did a melancholy customer just leave? He's indeed melancholic. I'm not talking about his looks. Don't you find his demeanor special? I mean, the kind of detachment and iffy vibe, the kind of solitude you expect from a genius. It's just fascinating. Ahem. <laughs> Talking about this topic makes me feel all flushed. Please, make me a drink. Hmm, I'll just order this chewing gum with a little more ice so I can cool down my internal cathode ray tubes. Alright, I should add some more ice cubes. Let's go, baby! Okay, so we want this. So she wants the chewing gum. Okay. And then a super size wine glass. More ice? She wants more ice, okay? Give it some sizzles too. <laughs> Stir. Then one puffer goat milk. Okay, next. Hamster ball night. Let's go! It's she. Her name is Lady. I see. It's a she. Oh man, I would drink this. Now I really want some alcohol. It's too late, but some alcohol will be great. A tantalizing taste indeed. You must be a seasoned drinksmith who can e easily grasp your customers' preferences. By the way, you've only been here for a short while. I wonder if you've noticed that things aren't very peaceful outside the lounge. Yes, please, I want alcohol too. Oh my gosh, I really want alcohol! It worries me too. I've always felt something creepy lurking deep within the hotel in the dreamscape. But if I want a quiet place, there's not much of an alternative. That's so frustrating. I can't find a good spot for a date. Why not have your date right here in the lounge? No way! There are too many acquaintances here, and customers can walk in any minute. It's too embarrassing. After some thoughts, the depths of this hotel seem like the best option. As long as I don't go too far, right? Who's the lucky person you're dating? Oh, wow. Or are you dating Xiuhan? Oh my gosh! <laughs> ah <-ha. laughs> You got the oh no! That's true, you can't drink any alcohol, but just, just pretend it's alcohol. Just like, oop, you know? Hello, Kamatora, hello. Are you dating Xiopan? Is it me? Heh, <laughs> trying to peer into Xiopan's love life, huh? Xiopan is so attractive and kind, and everyone wants to date her. I was interested too and asked her out a few times, but got rejected. So, I had to find someone else. <gasps> lore? Yo, uh, lore? I'm gonna screenshot this. Let's go. Well, it seems you enjoy discussing embarrassing topics. It's making, a, it's making me a bit flustered, to be honest. Give me another drink to cool me down some more. This time, I want something dreamy and super thick. And like before, I want more ice or my circuits are gonna fry. Would it be more effective if I just place ice cubes on her <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, we need. We could go for a large. Then we need more ice. Flavor base, you want dreamy, slightly sweet, and strong. Oh, I got the sheep them. Uh, move and flop. Welcome, welcome. Let's see, we want something sweet, right? We want something sweet.
let's go with this and then we go with something strong mm. ultimate syrup Ooh, and then we stir oh sexy okay so we need this to go very very thick okay uh very thick you want thick with the double c uh we could have mm. Hmm. I kind of want to add this. <gasps> Yo, guys, this looks so pretty. Look at this. It's pretty. I like it. Next, uh, I'm gonna put. Uh... <gasps> it's a pepeshi. Let's go, Pepeshi boy. I love this. I love this so much. Let's go. This is so pretty. I love it. Oh, yeah. Let's go, baby. It's so pretty. It's so good. Nice drunken event. We're all being... We're all going drunk here. You're a perfect drinksmith. So skilled and caring. This was a great experience. It was nice talking to you. In my opinion, you're almost as great a drinksmith as Yopan. Impressive indeed. I'll drop by next time. Please look forward to my arrival. You're so nice, lady. She's probably just easily embarrassed. Lady is probably the most normal along among all the monsters that you've come in contact with so far. Yeah. Yeah, she's so normal. Ah. I see, that's nice. Let's continue our service, okay? Oh no, it's Tin Man again. Hey! Hey, come closer. Let's keep this just between us. Did a customer in red come just now? Why do you say I can't hear you? Uh. Hey, hey, keep her! What is that? What is she? Oh, you like her! Oh, oh, oh. The tea is hot. The alcoholic tea is hot, I guess. Mm -hmm. I see you like her. I followed her right to the door of this lounge and watched her come out. So don't try to fool me. What did she talk to you about? And did she mention my name? She mentioned a melancholic customer. I knew it. I knew it. She just can't get enough of that blasted poet. Is his potential literary his literary accent so fascinating that she's still holding on to it? Well, forget it. It's not worth getting worked up about such nonsense. Just do your job and get me a drink. I want something in a large glass that's a little bitter with pretty colors. You know what pretty means? It means to separate the layers more clearly. Don't make it cloudy like dishwashing water. You're still so fixated on layering colors. Yeah, let's go. Ah, we understand now! Let's go! Oh my god, I hate this Tin Man. This Tin Man is so annoying. I hate it. <laughs> okay. You want slightly bitter? I'll give you more ice. I'll give you more ice. I don't care. Um, mm, Slightly bitter. Okay, so... We want... Uh... Mm. I can't mess. Uh, our concoction, and then probably we want uh like that. Stir this. Mm hmm. Then we can maybe add buffer goat milk. Oh my gosh, it's so ugly. It's so ugly. It's so ugly. It's perfect for him, guys. More ice means less water. Yeah, that's true. It's so ugly, guys. It's perfect for him. Oh shit, it's too... 
You want two layers? What? What is wrong with you? I'll make you the ugliest drink possible. Just you wait, okay? You want to make it? You want it? You want it so ugly? Huh? Okay, fine. Have it your way. Okay. We're gonna go like that. Um. We need a perf. We need the perfect mess. We need the perfect math. Um. This sucks. This sucks so bad. This is actually hard. Um. Okay, we got this and then you want minus one minus one. Okay. Plus two, so... Oh my gosh, this took like forever. You're so annoying. Okay, you're so annoying. I'll give you the ugly ass one, okay? Just because. I'll give you this ugly ass one. Oh, brother honey. Never mind. Ugly ass one. Fine, if it works, it works. This is actually surprisingly pretty. So I'll take it. Alright, I'll take it. Ha! That's more like it. Not many people can satisfy me. Now I'm slightly impressed with you. Uh, sir, don't come hitting on me, okay? I have someone I already like. Just saying. Oh, hey! I just remembered something. Were you rude to me the last time I came here? And did I say... I'll teach you a lesson? No, you remembered it wrong. Hey, chill out. I thought about it and I realized I was a bit too aggressive and there might be some kind of misunderstanding. I apologize for that and I hope we can be on better terms. So you see, next time that guest comes around, could you put in a good word for me? No need for flattery, just mention my name more often. You gotta do better than that, you gotta bribe me. Like, um... You could bribe me with uh, some EXP materials. <laughs> he just wants he just wants a date, Fate. He just wants a date. You'll do me the small favor, won't you? What's in it for me? You see, if you make me happy, I'll drop by more often and you'll receive more tips. But what if I don't want to see you? A great deal, isn't it? You get paid and I get served. A win-win situation for both of us. <sighs> Tin Man needs to meet Archeron to be humbled. I know, right? Everyone in this lousy lounge takes orders from me. What's the point of mixing drinks all the time? Stay on my side and I'll ensure you a happy life. My idea is... Nobody refuses my offers because I'm always right. I refuse. You! You have no idea what's good for you. I shouldn't have expected anything from a lowly waiter. Making drinks is the only thing you're good for. Give me something in an extra large glass, very sweet and tastes super intense. And it's gotta have pretty layers. I'm not paying if any of my criteria are not met. Do you think I'll let you leave without paying? Because you're so annoying. Okay, that's too immense, but uh Extra large. Um... Uh, more ice, just to be bitter. Uh, let's see. Very sweet. Um, we need very sweet, so... Okay, so very sweet. This could be a very pretty color. 
so we can stir this very sweet Mm. Hold up. Let me just try. What if I do this? Puffer goat milk. Stir. Okay, we stir this. All right. Oh my gosh, it's so ugly. Never mind. Um. I just want something pink. Very sweet. It's so thick. Uh. This is so ugly. This is so ugly. I think I can do better. Um, what if I do this? Stir. What if I stir this? Oh my gosh, why is it so ugly? That is so ugly. Okay, so we want... Okay, we want this. Let's just go with this, okay? We do not stir. We do not stir. We'll give him the thickest ass <laughs> milkshake that anyone has ever seen, okay? He's so annoying. He's so annoying. I'll give him this. <laughs> Look at it. It has three different freaking layers. Oh my god. Ew. This is so funny. <laughs> not bad, but this is not the end. You'll need to serve me until I leave this lounge. Well, I've calmed down a bit. I've almost finished my drink. But I'm not done talking. How long are you intending to work at this lounge? How long do I have to wait if I don't want to see your face again? Whenever you come, I'll be here. The very thought of talking to you annoys me. Just fine! I'll show you how to be a competent attendant. Meet me there when you're done. I'll be waiting. What? You're still being so rude to me. I learned a lot about Tin Man through our chat. You should be willing to be honest with me now. Okay, so we got 100% trust. I have a meeting to attend. Is the alarm clock waiting for me at the lounge? Uh, hello, sir. It's so thick, isn't it? The lounge is just a few steps away. What took you so long? If I want to get a refill, do I have to wait forever? Check out my watch. You're half an hour behind schedule, and the ice in my glass is already melted. Is something wrong with your timing? Is that what you should be asking? The customer is always right, and if you can't even get that, then why are you even here? He's being honest, right? Also thick as... Mm, thick. Honestly, I have no idea what Siobhan taught you. Let me fill you in. Uh, show me what you got then, I guess. Let's go. Watch and learn, new blood. This is what a good lounge should be like, okay? Hi, Gus Frogasaw. Hello, hello. Lovely to see you. Hi. Welcome back, Your Excellency, the esteemed and illustrious Lord TikTok. What the fuck? It is my utmost fortune to have encountered your presence. How shall I extol the sun? Your radiance surpasses the splendor of syrup, and the humble lounge gleams with your arrival. 
In my heart, you're akin to the... So glad to bottle cap. Without you, the entire bottle so glad. No, all joy will lose its meaning. Wait, that's not how he usually talks, right? Well said, my loyal servant. Now I find myself at a crossroads. Show me the answer to your dance steps that portend the future. Which beverage bef befits this extraordinary journey? Your will is my command, your excellency. Mmm, uh-huh. Yes, the heels of the dice indicate that the finest beverage shall be handcrafted by the drinksmith over there. Excuse me, are you looking at me? The drinksmith over there? Preposterous. She is not but a village girl I found from the inn. You believe an ignorant girl who can't even trace her lineage to possess the skill to brew the beverage I require? Ha! How intriguing. Hey, bring me! Before the sentence was finished, Mr. Bigwig suddenly ran over from a distance, shouting in alarm. Oh no! I got a hangnail somewhere. Huh? Why do I get hangnails randomly? Don't you hate it when you get a random hangnail? Master! Terrible news, Master! It's Madam! She, she's run away again! Where did she go? She's still inside the lounge. Excuse me. Well, no need to make a commotion. Inform her of my return and request her immediate presence. I've told Madam, but she wouldn't listen. She even said that. What did she say? She said she's going to be a drinksmith and will never come back. What? How outrageous. I shall personally inquire of her. What? What's going on? Oh my gosh. Where's Lady? Lady! 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 I'm curious, will that drink really work? Is mixing beverages so much fun that you wouldn't want to go home? Yikes! I beg your pardon. I did not intend to keep it concealed from you. I merely wished to bring you a surprise. I've heard of a skilled drinksmith at the lounge, and I desire to pay homage to your greatness. Hence, I came here intending to learn how to craft delicious beverages. Please, I implore you, do not be angered with me. What is wrong with this, this guy? During your expedition, I gathered numerous accounts detailing your magnificent achievements. Wait, what? Okay. Eh. Behold, which great hero led the Sweet Dreams troop to triumph against the Trash Can Kingdom? My head hurts. Which hero trampled the presumptuous tattle off beneath their feet and raised the banner of freedom and equality? We inquire, who is it? The soda bottles reply, it's His Excellency Marshal TikTok. We inquire, who is it? The billboards reply, it's His Excellency Marshal TikTok. We inquire, who is it? Replies the entire dreamscape, it's His Excellency Marshal TikTok. Me too, me too. I just wrote the poem for you. Please enjoy it. What the hell is going on? I want to know too. Behold the renowned General TikTok. In battle invincible, wisdom profound, valiant and skilled, a warrior's might, conquering his foe tattle off with his valorous light. <laughs> Such adulation. I was unaware that my renown had spread so far and wide, yet it is only befitting. However, let me enlighten you. That drinksmith is unsuitable. She is but an orphan I took in. She may tend to the tables, yet her ability to create anything of interest is doubtful. If you doubt my words, you... G good evening, Mr. TikTok. Looks like you failed to take heed of the lessons I taught you. When you speak, bow your head, extend your hands, and look up at me. How often have I instructed you to display courtesy to the guests? To the guests. But have you ever complied? I, I beg your pardon for my transgression. I'm... I've newly arrived at the lounge, and I'm unfamiliar with the rules here. I implore your pardon. Just how much are you afraid of, Siobhan? <laughs> Alas, debating with such an ill-bred servant is a waste of time. Well, bring me beverages and showcase the extraordinary talents of the personal drinksmith in the esteemed service of Sir TikTok, the illustrious one. 
Intrus, upon learning of your return from your expedition, I have prepared a commemorative beverage for your excellency. Not bad at all. Come forth and announce with honor. What shall this glorious beverage be named? The defeated governor. What? Are you being sarcastic? Please, calm your ire. The name was chosen to make a statement, and the beverage was inspired by your resplendent countenance. The black layer at the base signifies a fierce and savage battlefield. The white layer at the top denotes despair. And the blue layer in the middle represents your composure and unyielding resolve. Okay, so black, black, blue, white. Okay, black, blue, white. Even when you stand as the sole survivor, you retain the will to forge a path through the darkest wilderness. Well said. Look, even the drinksmith I took in is well cultured. Learn from her, my servants. Hey, newcomer, find a befitting seat for me and bring my beverage. Hurry. Ah, <sighs> fine. Oh? Well, if the alarm clock took the bait, I'm going to drink the beverage. Thankfully, I'm good at pretending you almost let it slip. I do want to make it mad. I did nothing wrong. Woof woof. Hey, it's just a record piece of metal with a bigger head. I think it's nobler than everyone here. Gah! Knock it flat and let's play kick the can. I'll get Miri in here. Come and help us, newbie drinksmith. Gah, how should we do with it next? I can't wait to start the fun. How about shoving the stir stick into its spring hole and spinning it hard? I, I, I'm all fired. Are you guys okay? I've wanted to do this since long ago. Ah, speaking of who can make my heart skip a beat, it's gonna be you. And now the moment for vengeance is at, is at hand. We'll wait. We'll just wait for the curtain to rise. That beverage is on the counter across the room and I've added some special ingredients for it. Ingredients to it. Making it drunk for a couple of hours won't be a problem. It's time to teach the disobedient child a lesson. However, this is only its imagined world. Your actions may be hindered, but let's play it by ear. We prank him? Yes, we do. Take away your one string. Wait, two glasses? Oh no! Serve his special drink. Serve it. Too sluggish. What kind of waitress indulge in cell phones during working hours? Show some respect. Where are your manners? Show deference defer in light of my presence. Bring me my drink. Ah, why two glasses? Can't you even tell the colors apart? I must recall which drink is the one Xiu Han sp specially prepared. The bottom layer black, black blue. It is the bottom layer black. Middle layer blue. Top layer white. That's the drink. Yeah, do it. Aha! A beverage of extraordinary taste. This exemplifies the essence of respect and affection. Look at the beverages you mixed before. Could they ever aspire to grace an honored pa patron's goblet? Hello, corpse. Hello. Wait, why am I feeling a bit sleepy? Is this drink too potent? But this can't be. I'm the... Boy, you're awake. <laughs> look at that pitiful look on your face. You've been acting all high and mighty here, but guess what? You're just a nobody in this lounge, and you had the audacity to call me your wife. <laughs> Who in their right mind will marry a fool like you? Definitely not me. Tada! Here comes the drama of vengeance. You, you were just playing along, but. Isn't this my dream? So, why? I'm the owner of Dream Jolt Whole Story, and I prepared all those drinks. I'm sure you understand now, right? You're finally awake, Skyrim. Oh shit. Did I treat you too gently before? Or have you entered your rebellious face? How dare you say that you plucked me from an inn? You've got some nerve. Siopan looks so scary when she's angry. I never spoil misbehaving kids. They need to face the consequences. Pampering them is the worst way to teach them. Remember that. I'll leave the rest to you. Just don't go overboard. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Could you please bring me the stirring stick? I've been wanting to try it for quite a while. Hehe. <laughs> the 
The subsequent material is not suitable for viewing. This performance ends here. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I should have believed their monsters are teased your pun. I was talking nonsense. It was all a joke. No, stay away from me. Uh, okay, I mean, we solved it, so, like, um, it be what it be. It be what it be, people. Phew! Phew! How's it going, Lord TikTok? It's all my fault. I'm so sorry. The drink you made was tasty. And the whole vibe here was awesome. I'm totally loving this place, and I'll definitely come back again. Oh, I'm taking my leave. See you. He's like, peace out. What's making him so scared? Something's not right. I should follow him outside and check things out. We're stalking him? Ooh, woof. A big care for the new radio I just found. Don't even think about touching it. <laughs> Look, my hands are puny and feeble. I won't wreck it. I want to hear the sound you mentioned too. <laughs> It'll be really quick, okay? Oh no. Hey there, I've come all the way to... Woof! A batter baddie is coming! I used to be such an annoying troublemaker! I'm so sorry! Woof! Did I hear that right? That big guy doesn't have a brain and that's for sure. Let's leave him be and have fun. <clears throat> Looks like his problem's resolved for now. Let's hope he gets along with the other monsters in the future too. Okay, good, good. We solved his problem. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. What was that? That was so funny. Yo. What even was that all about? Oh my god. Ooh, oh, oh, revenue statistics. Do we got some new stuff? <gasps> we got... Oh my gosh, we got tracks of destiny. We got the good stuff. Okay. We got recipe deduction! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Beautiful enemy. Let's see. Mm. Stir. And then put like this. It's pretty... It's very sweet. I would drink this. I'll drink it with like... Puffer goat milk. Yummy. More jades. Nyum nyum. Recipe successfully did you. Let's go. Okay, next one would be... Station of Freedom. Uh, uh. It's this one. And this one. Stir... And then we have this. This one is obvious. Let's go! Would we'll drink anything she makes. Ah! I'll try not to disappoint you, fate. I'll try not to disappoint you. Very sweet, very refreshing. I want this! One half longing for the future, the other memories that haunt. Oh, this looks good. Let's go. Emotional indigo. Let's begin. Da, da, da. Yeah. Do, do, do. This one's obvious. Let's go. Yep, and nice water. Give you a nice water. Very nice. 10 stellar jades. Oh my god, we're, we're going nuts. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go. So, what's the mission? What's the mission then? We have a mission. Okay, head to the dream, Joel Osterley. That alarm clock was a pain, but now he seems quite prudent when he is calmed down. 
almost ready. Time to open for business. Okay, let's go. Okay. We open for business, baby. We baby. You know, we can't understand each other. Despite our efforts to communicate, our paths are destined to remain apart. If that's the case, what purpose does language serve? Is our desperate cry for understanding merely an exercise in futility? Tell me, strange drinksmith, do you hold an answer? Many things are doomed to futility. <sighs> Seeking answers to such questions is akin to waiting at a station for a ship that will never arrive. Let it go. Let's simply have a drink. Only the warmth of that liquid can offer solace to my tormented soul. Please give me a small glass of tears. I just wish to quietly savor the intense bitterness that life has brought me. If you happen to... And I do mean happen to have some decorations that can remind me of the audience back at the theater. Please put it on. I'd like to see it. Thank you. Hmm... Okay, let's just start. Hi, Luca. Hello. Hello, hello. Okay, we'll have like a mini wine glass. Mini, this is cute. Bitter. Bitter. Okay, no ice. No ice. Okay, we'll go with no ice. You want butter? Hmm. Hmm. What color is this? Bitter... And then... Maybe another one up there... You know what? It works, it works. Uh, next. Representing Pentaconians? Uh... I mean... Probably... Clocky? Clocky is great. Clocky. Everyone knows Clocky. He's he's Pentacony, alright? Let's go. Wait, doesn't? This one? So which one is it? Oh, it's the Pepeshi? Oh my god, it's Pepeshi. What? Lol? It's Pepeshi. It's Pepeshi. Let's go. Okay, it's kind of ugly though. I'm not gonna lie. A wonderful mas a wondrous masterpiece. Your hands possess an enchanting touch, effortlessly mending the wounds within me. Ah, <sighs> passionate emotions are transient. The glass is empty, yet the void in my heart remains unfilled. Okay, order another drink then. Thankfully, this delightful drink has made us acquaintances. You know, before I came to this lounge, I was a struggling actor relegated to countless minor roles, plagued by desolation. No direction, no income, and no self-esteem. Regrets have permeated my life. Do you think I can still discover happiness? What is happiness anyway? <sighs> a piercing question indeed. Happiness is but a facade, with the world oblivious to the pain and suffering concealed beneath. I'm like a character in a play, confined to mimicking the words of others. I can't change the situation or myself. The past continues to haunt me. Even in this paradise, the dreadful nightmare persists, and the sadness within me never fades. It's not something a few drinks can wash away, but... Do go on. <sighs> it's impolite to expose my wounds without permission. It's better to share sorrows, experience joys, and bid Pharaoh appropriately. Better make an order first. Please give me something in a large glass, as thick as you can make it, and taste a little intense. Most importantly, a little more love, please. What's the love you mentioned? Once, I was fervently obsessed with plays, dreams woven from vibrant costumes and makeup. Unfortunately, my love became lost in the past. Based on its habits, it probably means it wants a decoration related to cartoon characters. Oh. 
Hi, Suzuka. Hello. Hello. How's the doggo lady doing? We're doing great. We're doing great. Hopefully, my voice lasts. Um, hopefully. Let's go with a large vintage glass. Uh, you want thick, right? So no ice. And so we want thick, right? We want thick. We want strong. So we have. What if I do this? One, two. And then I just go like that. Lamal? What if I stir? Maybe I shouldn't stir. Okay, strong. That means I shouldn't adjust the intensity. Mm. Mm -hmm. Let's go for something like that, okay? Ornament related to animated characters. Not clocky. Not this. Hanu? I feel like Hanu hasn't had his time yet. Yeah, let's go. Hanu hasn't had his time yet. Let's go. It's pretty. Aww. No more bunny day in Animal Crossing? What? What's that? I don't even know what Bunny Day is, but it sounds like a pain in the ass. I'm glad it's over then. Brother Hanu! Brother Hanu! Brother Hanu! Let's go, let's go! Oh, time sees your march! This drink is so exquisite, and I yearn to savor its flavor for the remainder of my days. Despite the sorrow clouding my heart, your kindness and drink-mixing mastery have deeply impressed me. <sighs> Farewells always carry a tinge of bitterness, but please, do not lament our encounter. Damn. Melancholy's mood doesn't seem to be getting any better, but it feels like its trust in me has deepened. Okay, we write. However, it's not good to always wallow in the past. Uh, continue the service. Oh, hi, lady. Hello, there. Here we meet again. The melancholic customer just left. Hee <laughs> hee. Why so serious? You've been a drinksmith for quite a while, and I'm sure you know better than to speak your mind. Oh, I came to see you because I heard something interesting and wanted to share it. Well, if you're not interested, then forget it. Oh, I love gossip. Hee <laughs> great! But I'm feeling a bit thirsty now. Could you make me a drink first? Hmm, this time I want an uplifting and refreshing drink that I like. Don't add too much ice. I've been feeling under the weather lately. I remember she used to... ask for a lot of ice cubes, so she doesn't need ice cubes this time because she hasn't brought up any embarrassing topics. <laughs> Thanks for the IJ, because do drink it. Mm. Hmm. Hydrate. Okay, we'll go for a large. Okay, so we want less ice. Okay, less size next. Slightly sweet. Um... Slightly sweet and mellow. Mellow. Stir. What does this look like? Ooh, pretty. You want something that's refreshing, okay? Okay. Maybe something like that. Hmm. Minus... If I add perfect milk... It's gonna cancel it out. But at the same time... I will add something that is like... Uh, minus one. How about this one? This one. Hmm... Very nice, very nice. Next. It does something refreshing, right? 
You want something refreshing? Refreshing. We'll have this bird. We haven't seen this bird for a while. Let's go. It's pretty. Ah, very sweet. Mellow, refreshing, uplifting. Look at this. Ah, so nice. Ah, pretty. It's a pretty green. This tastes amazing. You still understand me so well. If only you could stay here forever by my side. Well, now that I've finished my drink, it's time to share the interesting story with you. Actually, I stumbled upon Siobhan's secret by chance. Care to explain? I was wandering around the hotel in the dreamscape when I spotted a gorgeously dressed lady searching for something. It's rare to come across an outsider in this place, so I followed her for a while. Then I overheard her murmuring something like... She wanted to hang out with Siopan, but had been turned down had been turned down multiple times, so she decided to come straight to the lounge. She even said Siopan would definitely accept her offer this time. It's as if they've known each other for ages. If you were in that lady's shoes, would you keep trying to contact Siopan? Thank you for your invitation. Ooh, that's tough. Even if you say that, it's not easy to suppress what's on your mind. I'm sharing this with you because I'm also holding on to many secrets and I'm hesitant to reveal them. But then again, I'm too timid and those words get stuck in my throat and swallow the bag. <sighs> Should I ask him out and boldly express my feelings to him? Don't make decisions you regret. Mm, but it's not that simple. I'd like to bother you to make a drink that is very slightly bitter in a small glass. And it has to taste really mellow. Just a little ice will do. Just like my current mood. Upset. Is she worrying about something related to melancholy? Ah. Let's go. Okay, so it has to be small. It has to be small. Small vintage glass. Size next, slightly bitter, slightly bitter. So slightly bitter. Very mellow. Slightly bitter and hmm. Why if I do this stir? Gold and then add this. You want bitter? You're gonna get it. Then I'll give you like a sliced lemon to go with this, uh, whatever this is. Ah, slightly bitter, very mellow. Hey! It's a shimmery yellow. Hey, hey, very nice. I'm getting good at this, guys. Fantastic. This drink is exactly what I wanted. You truly understand me the best. Talking to you has made me feel much better. It seems your talent for conversation matches your skill in mixing drinks. If only I could chat with him as effortlessly as you do. Nevertheless, I must take action. I'll come up with a plan. Wait for my good news. Yes, I'm a pro drink smith. Pro drink smith. Yes, let's go. Lady decides to find melancholy. Hope the conversation just now can help and make up its mind. It was quite willing to share its inner thoughts with me. So I record it down. Okay. It's not easy to face your heart once again after you got used to running away. Ah, interesting. Very nice. Very nice. No other customers now. I'm a bit tired. Let's call it a day. Oof. Phew. Did someone just breathe on me? Phew. 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 <laughs> Very simple or something. What's happening? A real person here? I thought Siopan put a drink mixer here. Do I look like a drink mixer to you? Yeah, right. You can even find talking billboards in the dreamscape. Who knows if you're a real person or not? 
You know he has a point. There's a noisy dice and a stupid alarm clock. Once you've seen too many animated objects, you'll struggle to tell them apart from real people. So what brings you here? Drinks, of course. Didn't Siopan tell you? Give me a glass of paper moon. Since you want to be a drinksmith here, let's see what you're made of. You're a big shot at the lounge, I guess. There's no status difference here. But it's true that I usually take care of the others. I want a glass of paper moon. Don't forget. His words always imply something. Siopan never mentioned that Starlet could be so difficult to get along with. She never mentioned anything. Okay, let's go with the paper moon. Let's go. Start mixing. Okay, so mini wine glass, less ice, da, da, da. one iso glass, one blossom dew, one puffer goat milk, and then next we need to add the pepeshi fluff bowl. I would drink this. I would drink this. Right, what do we? She didn't mention anything. Like, oh my god. Oh my god, I would drink puffer goat milk if they love me. Not bad at all. Now I see Siopan did find someone decent to take her place. What did Siopan tell you? To fix us up? We've been working here for a while. So, what do you think of those monsters? Are you excluding yourself? I know exactly what I am, and I don't need you to remind me. They look pretty unique, though they're a bit eccentric and have their own emotional problems. They can be quite adorable once you get used to them. Is that what you're thinking now? You won't believe anything I say anyway. Forget it. You wouldn't give an answer even if I asked. Humans are all good at lying and their words don't hold any water. You're the one who asked first, right? Hm. Make me another drink. In an extra large glass, dream me with a thick texture. Is this request too difficult for you? Feels like he's not just here for a drink, but more like testing me? Uh, let's see, okay, so we got extra large. We need an extra large vintage glass. Okay, we need uh, more ice because I don't like you. Um. We need... Slightly sweet. Limau. So we need slightly sweet. Strong. What color would this be? Oh my god, that's so ugly, sorry. Slightly sweet. Stir. Let's stir this. Great week ahead. Thank you, Ruka. Okay, so we have the flavor base of Dreamy. And then now we're gonna have to thick. Hmm. What else can I put here? I could put... Mm. <clears throat> Just something like this. Ooh, wow. This is this is like uh, this looks a bit weird, but never mind, we'll go with it. If it fits, it fits. Um I'll sour the hell out of you. Go. Hmm? A sour the hell out of me with this one. Mm hmm. 
Yeah, maybe I should fix the, the, the color a bit, but this is fine. It's indeed the flavor I was hoping for. Your drinksmith skills are more impressive than I expected. Well, making great drinks is not all about managing this lounge. There are way more problems to deal with here than you expected. Mmm, looks refreshing there, right? Soon, you'll know what I mean. Starlet is behaving normally. It just doesn't seem to like me. Okay. Okay, we just like write all this down. Alright, so we got this. Being a drinksmith is actually exhausting. How did Siobhan manage to keep at it for so long? Huh? They're still at the lounge. Hello? Are we gonna see the lepers? Are we gonna see the lepers? Excuse me. Well, hey there. It's a bit awkward, but I need to ask you a favor. I'm the most caring drinksmith here. Oh, I'm really fond of your gentle type. Alas, if only he could be as caring as you are. It's... well, it's... I have no idea why she asked me to stay here. This is just re this is just depressing. Why is it always me? There's so many other monsters, but she asked me to sit alone in this corner after business hours. Is she trying to bully me or something? And tomorrow she'll go around spreading my embarrassing story and ostracize me, right? Melancholy, she just likes you. Like, come on, you actually thought receiving a note meant someone was confessing their love to you? Or that fool actually fell for it. Did you see the nervous and expectant look on his face? Priceless. <sighs> What's the point of making such jokes? I'm not trying to bully you. I I just want to... <laughs> What's going on here? I should talk to them separately and find out what they really think. Melancholy are too real for this. Oh my god. Like, come on. Let's fix lady first. Oh my gosh. Lady, please. It's... It's... You know... I... I wanted to ask him to hang out. But I don't... Know how to go about it. Just be honest and tell him how you feel. You already came to this part. I'm good at chatting with people I don't care about. But when it comes to someone I do... How oh, can I say something so embarrassing? What about me? Yikes! Are you being jealous or something? Think about it. All the monsters here like you. Isn't it amazing to have so much happiness at... as happiness all at once? As if the Tin Man customers were enough because I faced them almost daily. So I'm like, oh no, plastic, oh no. I'm sorry to hear that. <sighs> I'm just... Well, I'm just used to saying things that make people blush. But when it comes to the moment of truth, I just can't speak out what I really want to say. Hey, there... Don't you have some awesome powers? Could you dive into my heart and see what is blocking me? Uh, sure, let's just go, I guess. Um... Okay, good night, Luna. Discover ladies' true feelings. And oh, let's go. Oh god. <sighs> Seriously. Okay, let's just go uh here first, okay? Let's just go here first. Okay. What we got? We got frick nothing. Okay, so that wasn't good at all. Okay, so let's just grab this. Okay, we come here. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, so we have to go here instead. Okay, so we gotta press this. And then we gotta go here. Okay, F. And then we go here. And then we go here. Wait. What? Wait, how do we get here? Wait, what? Hmm? How do I get there? Am I in the right place? Are they? We did this, right? We did this, and then now we're here. Oh, we have to. Wait, where? What do you do now? Are they? They led me all the way here and then... Wrong way, perhaps, I guess. Um, I'm supposed to go through here instead. No? Okay. Wait, what? What? Oops, that was accidental. Hi, lady. Aww. Well, I seem too impatient. Was it this one? Nope, there's nothing here. Don't worry, I'll solve this problem myself. No need to backseat, okay? Let's see. Mm -hmm. 
Did we do it? Oh, you found my true heart. You're pure and innocent deep down. It's easy to get hurt if you just tell others what's in your heart. Anyway, thanks for helping you figure out my true feelings. I won't run away anymore. That's sweet. Ah, thank you. 20 jades! Yay! Okay. <clears throat> okay, now it's Melancholy's time. It's so frustrating! Why do they have to make fun of me? Isn't there already enough sadness in the world? What a world! I had nowhere to go, and now that I've finally found a peaceful place, they want to bully me? <laughs> there, there. <laughs> I know it's awkward, but I just can't shake off my grief. <laughs> I've got to figure out a way to calm him down. Let's delve into his inner world. Ah, uh, help be a baby. Oh my eyes! Oh my god! Shh. Let's go. Enter his evil escape, baby. Right, melancholy doesn't need to cry. Aw, don't say that. One day as a counselor. Ah, what to do? Activate. Activate. That should be easy. Should be. Okay. Come on, you'll be fine. Huh? Someone is coming over. See, I'm coming for you. Mr. Drinksmith, how did you get here? Wherever you are, I'll find you. You, an ordinary person? You're my superhero! It's so touching! Wah, wah. I'm not feeling so sorrowful anymore. Look, even my wings are starting to flutter. Life feels full of joy since I met you. The tragedy is finally ending, and the comedy is about to begin. Don't forget that someone is waiting for you. But really? But how can that be? No, no, I should stay positive. I've got to remind myself that everyone likes me. Maybe not to that extent. Yeah, let's go! Toward the sweet future. Aww, that's so cute. Aww. That is actually very cute. <gasps> yeah, we got all these new drinks. Let's go. More drinks, more drinks, more dates, more dates, more dates, more dates, more dates, more dates. Then I'll take my leave, all right? Thank you, you've been so kind. All right, and now with the public display of affection. Hehe, <laughs> a gentle person like you will be popular wherever you go. If you ever feel lonely, I'll ask you out next time. But for now, please give us your blessing. Ah. Oh no. Who we gotta beat up? Who we gotta beat up? Huh? Outside the lounge. So we gotta go out, I think. Wait. How do we go to the lounge? Beep, beep, beep. Uh, we leave the lounge. Wait, I hear... I heard a chest. Maybe it was my imagination. Is it... Let me try and leave this place. Uh. Oh, prep safe. Should I just like beat them up? 
you know, I think we'll we we'll agree. We can just like. Uh, Lamau, this food prep station is very funny. What? What? That's so weird. Okay, chest. Oh, we can yank this thing out. Yank. Yank! Yay! Okay, thank you for the bakalava. Okay, so we got like. Okay, we have. Let's just let's just uh, be ourselves. Uh... <laughs> okay. Pew pew pew! Auto play time, guys. <laughs> Got the voice the bird makes so cute, right? It's so cute. Oh. Excuse me, I burped. Oh no, it's gonna explode. It exploded. Hmm. <laughs> Boom. I'm sure they will they will be able to beat everyone, right? Go, Daniel, go! Go, Daniel, go! Oh my gosh, his shields are getting fatter and fatter. I love it. Is it time for me to have a snack? I think I'll have a snack. I probably should have had a snack. <laughs> time for snack. Snacks are great, guys. Wait, why are there so many? There's so many of them. Mm, hydrate, thank you guys. I'll hydrate twice. Oh, we'll just do something. That's so dangerous though. Watch out, no, 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 don't do anything. Ah! Oh my god. Good lord! Uh. No! Losha is down! No! <laughs> They're all gonna go down. Will they survive? They're all gonna go down. They're gonna go down. Oh, 
This is why you don't auto. Stop insulting my choices! Hmm. Well, first of all, how how was I supposed to know to bring out like seven TVs? Can you just retreat first? Let's just retreat. Is there a way to teleport there? Yeah, let's just teleport here. Hmm? We might as well like, deal with this one here. Oh wait. After some time, eh? Hey. Yeah, it's really annoying. That's nice. Oh my gosh. Precious treasure, please. Wait, was this? Oh, that a different elevator? Okay, finally. Ugh, I don't want to die yet. I just decided to live a happy life from now on. I don't want. C calm down, darling. I I'll protect you. Rawr. Woof. Get back your senses. You. You don't recognize us. Rawr. Woof. I won't let you harm them. Come help New Dream Smith! Starlet has lost his mind! Fine, fine. That's Let's try this, I guess? I honestly wouldn't know what happened to him though. That means you have to beat the rest. If I do this, then I'll get a shield. Yep. Okay, debuff, debuff. Okay, let's just support. No, my, we don't support anyone. Let's just hit you. 
Okay. Let me just beat you up. He's not down yet. Ah. Hmm. Let me restore himself. Uh -huh. Should deal with it. Yeah, we have defeated him. Wolf, wake up! What happened? How could this be? How? Even the wisest thinker among us, among his, us, has lost his sanity. As I thought, it is indeed that happiness is transient, while sorrow seems everlasting. Who can tell me? If we are doomed for ruin, why were we brought into this illusory sweet dream in the first place? He was fine the last time we met. Why did he suddenly become frenzied? I should inform Xiokhan as soon as possible. What should we do? You're a smart one, new drinksmith. So there must be something you can do. Let's bring him back to the lounge first. Woof, I'll lend a paw. Very good. Good lord, damn. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Let's go back to... Oh? No 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 you didn't see anything no 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 you didn't see anything I don't want blah 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 Woof! Looks like he's okay. He's a regular at the lounge, but why did he lose his mind all of a sudden? Will I end up like that someday? That's scary. We all meet our destined end someday. Wolf, why isn't Xiopan here at a time like this? What is she doing, Wolf? I'll stay with you guys. <laughs> we'll go back for now, Wolf. As for you, new drinksmith, stay safe, alright? The monsters all left the lounge one after another not long after that. I've received your message. How are the monsters doing? You tell Siopan and da 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 Oh no, Siopan has been expecting this! No! Poor thing! Oh no! I just checked on him. Nothing serious. He'll regain his senses soon. I'm sorry, I didn't see it coming. Thank you for your help. Are you hiding something from me? Chill out, I just came back, and I'm a bit tired. You're a skilled drink, Smith. How, so how about whipping up a drink for me? Okay, let's go. Let's start with you. What would you like to know? Your true identity? Hey, don't rush things. The answer to your question is way too nuanced. How am I supposed to answer them all in one go? I feel a little parched. 
Make me a refreshing drink. And keep it mild. I'll leave the rest to you. I trust your mixology skills. Okay, it's uh... Small? More ice? Like that? Less ice then. So we want refreshing. So then maybe uh like this very few flavors. Why not? Let's go with this. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try this way. Like that. Stir. Oh my gosh, it's so ugly. Sorry, forget that. Um, rejuvenating? What's this? One dream jam and then a little champagne like that. Why do we very few flavors? So like two only? Mmm like that. Champagne. And then just like this, maybe. Oh, something very simple. Ah, uh, okay. I think this suits you. Let's go. And then we'll go with like a standard uh, sliced lemon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is good stuff. Very pretty. Drinks you make always brings back memories. You didn't secretly use your magical ability on me, did you? Why not take a guess? No? Maybe you can try using it on me and see if it works? Just kidding. I say that because as long as I sit opposite you, I feel super relaxed. Like I'm in a, like I'm in a warm, cozy dream. Unfortunately, dreams don't last forever. Just like this hotel. Oh man. I'm sorry, I should have explained everything about this dream joke whole story better. Those monsters don't show aggression most of the time because of your drinks. The drinks offered here can stabilize their emotions, helping them resist the nightmare corruption to some extent. Why don't we stop making them drinks? Just as you saw, they'll lose their sanity and start attacking everything around them until... Until they're beyond recovery. Oh no! Even with my drinks, they still descend into a frenzy from time to time, and it's happening more frequently now. The entire dreamscape is collapsing, and we're just futilely trying to delay its impact like pouring cold water into a pot about to boil over. The situation of this lounge is far from promising. So that's why Starlet became frenzied? Well, the situation is a bit different. They have experienced too many tragic tragic events, so they're naturally wary of strangers in the lounge. Don't be fooled by their mature look. Deep down, they're still a dependent kid. They're just too wary to completely trust you right away. So don't take it personally. I'm sure they'll open up and show their true feelings once you two become more familiar with each other. As for me... Well, soothing emotions is what the family's used to doing, so there's nothing com complex about that. You're a member of the family. Yeah, I mentioned that. I used to be the administrator of the Sweet Dreams troop, but not anymore. The Sweet Dreams troop members are props entertaining the guests. 
No guest would want to hang out with a bunch of monsters that could go wild at any moment. So I lost my job and could only stay in this lounge, taking care of those quirky kids. To me, they're like my family, and I'm not leaving them behind. You've gotten so good at mixing drinks. Maybe I can trust you with this lounge. As the dreamscape collapses faster, more monsters will go frenzied. The drinks we whip up will only calm them down temporarily. And we have no idea when this whole mess will end. Are you feeling tired? Perhaps. Sometimes I can't help but wonder what my true desire is. Life isn't simple even in a dream, and hard work doesn't always pay off. That's just how the world works. I've got some troubles I need to sort out. Please take care of those kids while I'm gone. I hope you enjoy it here. Wolf, this way! Come this way! I've got something to talk to you about! Oh boy! Hmm... Let me just wrap up this bag of snacks. Well, don't you think Xiaohan has been acting suspiciously, like, suspiciously lately? She's never around the lounge these days. Where has she gone? I knew you'd feel the same way. As you know, Xiaohan is an amazing woman, so we've been wondering. Since she's been away a lot lately, could it be that she doesn't want us anymore? No! We've been a pain in the neck lately, and have caused a lot of trouble. Maybe she's not into us anymore? She always says she's busy with something, but never spills the beans. Come to think of it, Xiopan never mentioned what she's been busy with. Hey, new drinksmith, let's go outside and find Xiopan. It would be great if we could help her out, Wolf. I need to finish my work at the lounge first. Wolf, no problem. <clears throat> Let me make some preparations and figure out where Xiopan might be. It's a deal, Wolf. I promised him to look for Xiopan, but I need to finish the lounge work first. If I remember correctly, Starlet is the only one who is still troubled by his problem, right? Yeah, let's go. Oh, oh boy. Let's go for the deduction. Oh, Rose in the Rain is pretty. Let's go. Very bitter, strong, very thick. Rose in the Rain. Very nice. <clears throat> Begin deduction. Hmm. What's this? Stir. Mm hmm. Mung bean thing. Dream jam. Stella champagne. Then we add this thing thing here. Done! Very bitter, very strong. Oof. We've never seen the sunrise, but we still pine for light. Oh man. Nice. Okay, the last deduction. Prolonged past. Hmm. Okay, I got it. Like that? Okay, so we gotta like stir it. Very sweet, very refreshing, uplifting. I would drink this one. This is very pretty. Yay! We got it! 
Okay, so we've already deduced all of these new ones. What about this? Uh, submit tips. Oh, yeah. We're at the last level, guys. We're at the last level. We're at the last one. We got this. Time limit award. Oh, revenue level 7. Thank you. Mission progress. Yay. We are rolling in the dough, guys. We are so rolling in the dough. We are rolling, baby. Okay, so what's the mission now? Head to the dream job. <sighs> hmm. Do 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 do. Lady and Melancholy are really close. Lots of people are fond of their performances. I wonder how Starlet is doing. Will he show up today? As curious as I am, I should get the business started first. Okay. I think we're on the last mission, so let's see how we go. Let's see how we go about this, okay? We have this. Let's go. Greetings, I'm here for a drink, and this time, I'd like... I'd like... My visit here won't cause you any trouble, will it? What would you like? Okay, I want an extra large glass that's sweet and has plenty of color. Thanks for... The trouble. Wait, so many requirements. Why do you want layers? That's so much work. Please pardon me. It's my pursuit of beauty. In my opinion, vibrant and bright things are beautiful. While chaotic and monotonous things are ugly. While Stiopan said I have to have a drink, I think it's more interesting to have a touch of fun. Didn't expect it to become so serious after resolving its emotional issues. Let's go, baby. Extra large glass. Oh, uh, more ice. Next, uh, so you see. Oh, this is gonna be a bit of a pain. What if I stir this? Okay, then we need... There's something else that can make it look nice. What if I stir? Oh my god, that's the ugliest color I've ever seen. Okay, we want this champagne. We have some champagne as the base, and then we want uh, what if I stir this? That is so gross. I'm sorry, it's gonna take some uh, experimenting. Slightly sweet, so we could add mm. 
like this. Yeah, we'll just go with this. I'm not. I don't know what I'm doing. Or unless the sh unless I want the champagne to go on top. Let me try again. Okay, let me try again. I got this. I got this. Uh, like this. Stir. Then I do this. Do this, and then I do this. <coughs> Much prettier. Much prettier. Much prettier. Let's go. We could go for something cute. Let's go for the orange magami bird. Yummy! <laughs> I'll give it to you. You're a layering genius. The sweetness is just right. I quite enjoy it. Yay! Oh, thank you. Uh, a chew. Thank you. Your mixing skills are as excellent as ever. I really enjoyed this drink. It's just me. My mind has become so clear since we last talked. <laughs> Is this what salvation feels like? To repay your kindness, I did something incredibly daring. I lied to the frenzied fool and told him that Siobhan had called them to the lounge. I believe they will show up any minute now. I believe you'll be able to handle the situation when they arrive. Why did you help me? <clears throat> Because you saved me from going down the wrong path. So naturally, I should help your business in return. Hee <laughs> hee, as a reward, can you make me another drink? This time I want a large glass with a strong taste and thick texture and with a few more layers of color. Is this too much to ask for? Or if it's too much trouble, I'll change it right away. Let's just go. <laughs> oh no. Three color layers. Oh god, we need strong, we need thick. Uh, large. Okay, large. Uh, let's go. You want thick? Uh, thick. The size, so uh, let's see. We need three color layers, right? This is like, not strong at all. Uh, Mm-hmm. <laughs> I need to add another one. Okay, I got it. Hold on. Like that. One. Two. Like that. Oh, it is too thick. Oh no. So we need to balance the thickness as well. Hmm. Kalisa, thank you for the raid. Oh my gosh, how is everything? How is everything? Hello, hello. Hi, hi. You're playing. <laughs> hey, Kiyu. I guess it's going to be. It's gonna be a raid of several more people, right? <laughs> hi. Oh my god, party animals. That's all so fun. Hi, Ray. Hello. It's gonna. I'm gonna see. I'm probably gonna see Hoten and uh, who knows who else. <laughs> hello, everyone. Hello. Thank you for the many, many reads. Hi, Kazuki. Hello. I'm sure next up is Hoten, isn't it? <laughs> hello. <laughs> Hi, guys. Thank you. How was Party Animals? How was Party Animals? There, I knew Hoten was gonna be next. Let's go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> hey, hey. 
Hey, how was it? Was it wild? Um, uh, Ray, did you did you uh, beat Hoten up like I told you to? Did, did, did you do that? Because that is a very very important. Uh, as far as I know, you gotta you gotta beat him up. You gotta really like. You know what I mean? Yeah, you gotta beat beat him up. Mm, pretty good. Yes. Oh my gosh. No. Prediction on point. Ah, so you did get beat up. Wonderful. Oh, endless too. Hello, endless. <laughs> Hi guys, hi guys. Hello, 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 hey. <laughs> so uh, you guys came in uh, to my beautiful, beautiful stream where I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Uh, what, what am I doing? No, seriously, what, what am I doing? I don't actually know what I'm doing. Am I going to... I yeah, just punch, punch, punch and fight. I see, okay. Okay, that, that, that kind of works out, I guess. Wait, I need it thick, right? I need it thick. Sweats. Minus one. Uh, I can't math. I can't freaking math. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I'm just like, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, 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 uh. The thickness has to go down. The intensity has to go. So plus one. One intensity minus one. Oh my gosh. This took 10 million years for me to get. It's not pretty. Okay, it's not pretty. But we got this. All right, we got this. Uh, mint leaf. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, no. Cocky works. But... Yay. Jinx. 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 Jinx, let's go. Jinx, 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 jinx. <laughs> I can't math, guys. Math is hard. It's hard. Yeah, I hope, I hope it was fun, though. Like, I'll see you guys next week when you guys stream again once more. I just see, yeah, I'm pretty sure I poisoned someone uh, while playing. What do you mean you poisoned someone? Guys, do not poison your patrons. That's just not nice. Don't do that. Okay, don't do that. Also, welcome to the sheepdom, all the newcomers. Welcome, welcome. Yes, hi Raiders, I'm Yuri Shiba. I'm a Shiba VTuber. Just now, I was trying to make drinks and uh, we do not talk about how many times I remade that drink, okay? Um, uh, first try, first try, okay? When in doubt, first try. Hey, okay. So, I'm pretty new to Honkai uh, Star I think I've like played for like um, one and a half month. Soon to be coming to two months. And um, I still feel like an absolute baby. Okay, I still feel like an absolute baby. Sometimes I do tarot streams as well. Like I do tarot readings. Uh, as I'm speaking, I am holding onto my favorite deck because it's comforting holding a deck of nice cards. But yeah, that's kind of just me. <laughs> yeah. So if you like that kind of stuff, feel free to hang around. If not, uh, no, no pressure as well. If you guys, uh, for all the people who rate it in, if you guys need to rest, feel free to go and rest. If not, just like chill around. That's fine as well. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jitsu. Yeah, yeah. You can join the Discord. I'm trying to be more active these days. Okay, I'm trying to be more active. The Maltin man is rude. He is rude, but he's trying to be better. Okay, he's trying to be better. Aha. It's so delightful that it feels like all the gears in my body are shaking and every corner of my insides has been lubricated. I'm feeling so satisfied. <laughs> Thank you for the treat. That fool will be here soon. Here's a piece of advice. When talking to them, try to make them reveal their true thoughts. What they say is completely different from what they really think. I hate that type. Unlike me, I never hide my fiery soul. Haha. <laughs> I'll take my leave now. Good luck with your conversation. Okay, so we're gonna talk to the monk. We're gonna talk to the monk, guys. Monk it. I have to pila is great. Okay, bye. It was nice knowing you. It was nice knowing you. Goodbye. Deepest, you're still streaming? I was trying to complete the event. We're on the last one, Kiko. We're on the last one. Come on. Alright, now that I've resolved all the other monsters' problems, it's time to have a chat with Starlet. We get all of the jades today, okay? That alarm clock was lying about Siobhan calling me over, right? Well, if you got something to say, then say it. Why did you suddenly go all frenzied? It's got nothing to do with you. 
Looks like we'll be talking for quite a while. Get me a drink first. The same one I ordered the first time. Do you still remember? I've forgotten about it. Look at how foolish you are. I'll just tell you. It's Paper Moon. Don't get it wrong this time. Fine, fine. Pepper Moon it is, you ass. <sighs> well, at least it's like... It's, it's a fixed recipe, so that's not too bad. Wait, I so glad Blossom do... For goat milk. Oops. <coughs> Sorry. I thought it was the first one. Anyway. I'm so glad. Uh, Blossom Dew. Puff of goat milk. Next. And then one Pepeshi fluff ball. Let's go. Back about to pass away again. You can feel free to pass away. I'll talk to you when you wake up, Lamal. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Uh huh. JS who? Who's that? <coughs> okay, we got this. No, oh, this is exactly what I wanted. And its flavor remains the same. You do seem to have a good memory. I actually recall a lot of things. Oh, you just left Chengdu. Oh, it is a nice place. Understandably, you'll be upset to leave. I ordered the same drink because Siopan remembers the preferences of all the monsters here. She remembers clearly what flavors each monster likes and what requirements they have for their drinks. We may have quirky tastes that even we ourselves don't recall the reason for, but she just remembers them. It's amazing. So are you just trying to test me? Huff! <laughs> then do you remember what the other monsters like? Mm. Wait, what is Spade like? Spade likes... Uh... There's nothing special about it. <coughs> okay, yeah. And then melancholy. Melancholy likes decorations. Oh, that's so sad. That's so sad. And Mr. Bigwig likes Mr. Bigwig likes. There's nothing special about it. Yeah, they're not picky. Lady likes ice cubes. <laughs> it's like hoo, 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 embarrassing. He thought he didn't hit those thoughts well, but everyone saw right through it. Yeah. This lounge hasn't been around for long, but it's already filled with so many memories. Where's Tin Man? Oh that pompous alarm clock. Let's not mention him. But if someone tries to mess with this place, he's always the first one to jump in and stop the trouble. It's all kind of mundane, but looking back on it, it's fun. Oh, just look at me chattering away. Make me another drink, please. I want a drink that's large, very sweet, and tastes mellow. Best if it's refreshing. Perhaps I need to calm down. Okay, large. You want a large drink. Okay, we'll go with a large. Uh... Restart mix. Uh, on a large vintage glass. Okay, one very sweet, mellow, refreshing. More ice will work. Okay. More ice will work. <coughs> this event can give you so many jade. You'll be stupid not to like do it. I think I'm on level 5. No, I'm on level 4. Level 5? I think I'm level 5, I think. Oh, this is tough. Okay, we need sweetness. Uh -uh. We need sweetness, okay. Mm-hmm. We got the sweetness. Then we need... Mellow. Okay, we need sweetness. Mellow. Minus one. Ooh. Okay, refreshing. Minus one. Let's see, we tried this. 
minus refreshing right so we need minus two like this minus two minus one plus one good lord i don't know what monster this is but it is what it is okay next huh we'll put the uh, hamster Ball night. This is very nice. Hamster all night. Yeah. Monopoly lucky river. Yeah, it does take. Uh, yeah, just just take your time. Yeah. Yeah. I also want fusion. I don't want fusion. My friend recommended me fusion. Kiko. Uh, I think she's passed away already. But like you know, she's like passed away. <laughs> we'll see her sometime. It tastes great. I've been observing you for quite a while, and you're becoming more and more like a skilled drinksmith. Now that I've said so much, it's your turn now. A good drinksmith shouldn't just listen. They should be able to guess what's on their customer's mind. You've been in this lounge for some time. What have you noticed? You really care about this lounge. Why do you say that? You've been testing me from the beginning. You're sharp for a temporary drinksmith. What else have you figured out? Tell me. Actually, you didn't go frenzied back then, right? Wait, really? Go on. You were trying to scare me into leaving. Or you didn't harm those monsters. Frank Kiko is dead? No, she's just temporarily dead because she slept four hours, don't worry. Excuse me, you hate adventuring? Do we even see the same story? How can you hate adventuring? How? That's impossible. You can dislike him, but hate him? That's pretty... That's pretty... Uh... Heavy, Lamo? Hi, Antarian. Hello. Get me a large glass with a touch of brokenness and a hint of sweetness, but at the same time, it needs to have a thick texture. I really want to try it now. Sparkle lock into your vein. Yeah, he got taken over by Sparkle. Don't worry. Let's see. Large. We did that. So we'll go with this one. Flavor based broken souls. We need slightly less ice. Okay, we need less ice. Then we need flavor base. The flavor base can be. Hmm. Maybe soothing soda and like blossom dew maybe. Then we stir. Okay, so we got this broken, very sad one. Okay, then we have slightly sweet. So slightly sweet, we can go with like uh, thick. Okay, first we need. One, we need sweet and then we need thick. So, one thick, one thickness. We could have this, and then we could have like one sweet, like that. Never mind, let's go again. Uh, soothing soda and straw. Awesome, do you? Soothing soda. Just stir it. Okay, and now we need to make sure it's slightly sweet. And it needs to be thick. So we need one thick. One thickness. Hmm. 
You just need to add one thing. Alright. Um, what if I do this? Oh, this is bro. Wow. What if I add that instead? Hmm. I kind of want this in the middle. Okay. I want to kind of want that in the middle. So we go with um this one, this one, stir. Okay, and then we go with this red sunset sauce in the middle. And then we go with uh offer goat milk on top. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. He reminds me of Wonder, and I really dislike Wonder. Who the hell's Wonder? Okay, so what do we have here? We could give you maybe a mint leaf. This looks like a nice uh. Genshin, do you not play Genshin? I don't play Genshin, Lamau. Just because I play Honkai Star does not mean I play Genshin. Yeah, please don't assume. If not, you you should like ask to clarify. I like this flavor because there are a lot of things I can't get out of my head. As you know, we sweet dreams true our creation of the family to entertain the guests. The work that Xiaohan gave you was to calm us down, right? It seems you don't really understand what this goal really means to us. If you want the answer, come to the hotel in the dreamscape. Okay. Oh, he trusts us completely now. That's nice. Obtainable, I see. We have to like finish this yet. Max to reach. Oh, thank you. Okay. Chat with Star. Da -da -da -da. Is he there? Oh, he's right there. Let's go. Two and a half to monthly reset. Yeah, after we wrap this, I'm gonna end stream. Ah, thanks for the hydrate. I just did. You've come after all. Let's get it started. There's no point in repeated arguments as only facts can guide us to the path. I've prepared a mind space for simulation. Watch closely and see what kind of life we Sweet Dreams troop members are actually living. What would you choose if you were the one at the crossroads? Ready. Okay, we're going to go into the emo scape. Last one. Ooh, this is the... This is a dream bubble. No need to explain that. Starlet isn't around. Where is his voice coming from? Dream bubbles appearing in the hotel is a sign that the dreamscape is collapsing. The nightmare is spreading and the sweet dreams troop has been corrupted and become frenzied. For the family, this is a big problem that must be solved. However, for us, it might not be the same. What are you trying to imply? You must reach that room. Go experience it for yourself. I've made a few adjustments and you appear in my form in this space. Remember, the sights may be false, but everything you, you're you about to see did happen before. Oh... Head to that room. Look back at the monster's past. Woof! Let's play truth or dare! The person who gets called must choose between two truth or dare. Once you've completed the challenge, you can select the next one. Woof! Who should we start with? I prefer to be passive. I don't want to be the one who confesses first. You're not going to bully me. You're not going to bully me, are you? Well, I know it's a vote, but I'm pretty sure you all agree to pick on me. <laughs> That's not how you play. Well, let's think of a way. Hehe. <laughs> how about we start with that tin can? The big one should give way to the smaller ones. Nothing wrong with that. Alright, let me show you how it's done. Watch this. So truth? Or dare? I choose truth. That's no fun at all. Hehe, <laughs> alright, I'll ask you a question. Who are you most afraid of? Xiopan. Woof, that's cheating. It doesn't count. Hey, why not? It's my turn now. I'm going to pick... Hey, you, the red guy over there. Step out. Uh, I'm 
you're here. Did I call you? Go back. I mean, yeah, you. Yeah, I'll choose you. Oh, me? Yeah, um, now I'm asking. Who is your favorite one to be with? He is whipped for her. Hey, I haven't said I choose truth yet. Um, but fine. I guess I can answer this question. My favorite is... Well, you know... Oh, it's too embarrassing. I'll go up there. Alright then. Blink three times. That simple. Then I'll start. Do do do. Do do do. Next, I'm going to choose... Hmm, who should I choose? Why are you staring at me? Are you trying to bully me? <sighs> I knew it always end up like this. Hey, not at all. Hm, I'll go to the big guy over there. Hehe, <laughs> are you choosing me? Why is she pointing at me? Wait, can she see me? Hey, yeah, you. Truth or dare? My choice is... I'll go with truth. Oops, sorry. I, I clicked really fast. Alright, here's my question. You must have heard of this famous quote. For liberty, I will sacrifice my love. If it were you, which one would you choose? Liberty or love? Liberty. I'll choose... Ah, big stretch, thank you. <sighs> thank you for the big stretch. Ah. Uh, hmm. <laughs> I'll choose... B -b -b <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had this much fun in ages. Awesome. I love seeing you like this. Oof, it's so much fun. Yeah, so much fun. It's true that making fun of others is what makes comedy. But still, ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. My stomach hurts from laughing so hard. How did you come up with that trick? You're really something else. <laughs> so what exactly did you do back then? You don't need to know the details. Seeing them laughing so hard is all you need to know. Here we go. Oh. Here you will find two doors. Uh, let's just get straight to the point. The door on the left means yes, and the one on the right means no. Riddle me this. It's always a pleasure to spend time with friends. Are you willing to give up on this life? No, I won't. No way. We've been leading a happy life ever since we broke free from the family's control. Of course, the nightmare has left everyone emotionally unstable and conflicts have increased. But at least we don't have to worry or fear anything. We are free now. We can decide which path we want to take. Now, go back. You haven't reached the end yet. Okay, head to that room. Who there? Who there? What is wrong with you? Why should I keep your useless self around if you can't even roll the dice right? Uh, I'm sorry. I won't make this mistake ever again. Do you want... Big or small? You're asking me big or small? Are you really that stupid? Can't you see the situation on the table? If most guests bet, bet on the big side, you roll small. Otherwise, roll big. Have you forgotten what he told you? Let the most miserable loser win once every few rounds. And if someone questions us, find an excuse about having a tummy ache. The banker doesn't have to win all the time, but must ensure nobody loses too much money. Do you remember now, you buffoon? I, I need to use the bathroom. I'm asking you to lie to the guests, not to me, you fool. Bring me the whip and I'll make sure you never forget it. Woof, please don't do that. Scram, you stupid dog. All you do is chew on your stupid soda bottles. You can't even protect the house without causing losses. Get lost, now. Ah, that's so scary. I, I can't bear to watch such brutal scenes. <sighs> Let me cover your eyes. Master, maybe forget about it for today. And do it some other time? Did I ask you anything? Huh? Did I? This is just a warning. One more word and you're gonna get it too. I see. Bah! I'm in a bad mood. So I'll take it out on you. You're made for entertainment, but you can't do anything right and keep wasting my money. 
You're good for being my practice dummy. Oh no. I mean, this guy has very pretty eyes, but... Ugh. Hey, that's Markiplier. What? What? Lamal? What's the point of owning you, worthless pieces of junk? Why don't I just smash you up and sell you for parts? <laughs> Taking it out on them only makes you look pathetic and useless. Can you hear me? <clears throat> ha! So now you think you're some kind of hero, you big nitwit. You're gonna get it too. You think you're smart? You think you've seen it all? Ha! Nonsense. As long as I'm in charge, I can punish you as much as I want. Don't even think about fighting back or getting help from anyone. I'll punish you until you're scared. You only listen when you're scared, right? Oh no. Oh no. He got whipped. Like, literally whipped. Say something. Are you just gonna stand there and watch them get hit? Do you really think you can, you can erase the past and change the future by yelling at these illusions in front of you? Like I said, you are the former me. Here we go. Oh no. It's the same two doors as before. Can we have a different scene for once? The door on the left means yes and the one on the right means no. Riddle me this. Losing your freedom and being at the mercy of others is painful. Do you want to escape that kind of life? Yes. Of course we want to escape that kind of life. We led a miserable life when we served the family. We may be called the Sweet Dreams Troop, but there's nothing sweet about our dreams. Now that you've decided to help Xiopan and help us return and make us return to the Sweet Dreams Troop, do you know what that means? We'll lose our freedom and be at the mercy of others again. No one cares about what mere tools like us think. Breaking free is the only way to find happiness. The nightmare may be a problem for the family, but for us, it's our only chance to escape. Even if it drives me into a frenzy, I'm willing to risk everything at this point. What about Xiopan? Now go back. You haven't fulfilled your duty yet. Oh boy. Yeesh. There? I want to speak to your administrator. I can't believe you lost my room card. My luggage is still in the lobby. Who's gonna take responsibility if I'm delayed? Oof, please wait a moment. I'll go handle it for you. A moment? How long is that exactly? The family never waits when they're charging for a room or collecting money, but I have to wait? I want to see the person in charge right now. No delays, no excuses, or there will be consequences. Oof, but our administrator... Hehe. <laughs> Could we maybe not involve the administrator? How about this? I'll go get the concierge right away. It'll be quick, I promise. Are you telling me what to do? Shut up, I want the administrator now. I don't care what you do. Just get your administrator or else. Oh no. Does this happen frequently? Very often, pretty much every day. Let's stop here. I think you have your answer now. Oof. Now here are the final doors. The door on the left means yes, and the one on the right means no. Riddle me this. Now that you've seen the real past, do you think we should return to the Sweet Dreams troop? The so-called normal life is nothing more than just slavery for us. To us, abnormality means freedom. If we can't enjoy the Sweet Dream, why not embrace the other side? So what's your choice? Don't you already have an answer? Perhaps. Oh man. Wait, why am I back here again? Oh, that's your pun? What are you waiting for? How much longer do you expect me to wait? I apologize for keeping you waiting. I'm the administrator here, so please let me know how I can help you today. You're the one? You might look respectable, but you can't even teach your tools how to do things right. Are you too stupid or too incompetent to manage this junk? 
I apologize for all the trouble caused. The Iris family is willing to compensate you. Compensate me? Can't you even afford it? With your measly salary, your compensation wouldn't even cover the room bill for one system hour. And you have the nerve to talk about compensating me? Hey, this dog lost my room card and I want it back. Just the one that's lost, not the others. If the dog can't find it, then you do it. I don't care if you have to beg, borrow, or steal. I'm going to. Get out. Huh? What did you say? I said, I want you to disappear from Pentaconi. You can make yourself scarce on your own, or I can arrange for it. Your choice. Wait, I'm a guest of honor invited by the family. How dare you talk to me like this? Heh. <laughs> a guest of honor, huh? Well, I'll let you in on a secret. Not only do I dare to talk to you like this, but I also can do something about it. Oh, is that the invitation? In your pocket? Let me check it. I see it's signed by Maven, head of the Iris family. An invitation from Maven, huh? So it's okay if I tear it up, don't you think? In the blink of an eye, the gorgeous invitation is torn to shreds. Colors drain from the dream chaser's face instantly. Well then, now that you're no longer a guest invited by the family, you're just a nobody in a miserable basket case who bullies those little guys. Now would you kindly vacate the premises? You... You're nuts. I'm going to file a complaint. There will be consequences. And all that jazz. Exist that way. Farewell. Who's that lady? A new administrator? Uh, I don't know her, but but she looked so cool when she was scolding that bad guy. <laughs> You're so rude, right? Woof, I agree too. You are eternal foods. Congrats, you have, you have foods now. You guys are members of the Sweet Dreams troop, right? Don't be too polite to varmints like that. Because the more placating you are, the more they'll walk all over you. Chimkin strips and mozzarella sticks. No, share them with me. I want food too. Huh? <gasps> oh, okay. And remember, blah 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 blah. Watch out. Is this Siobhan before she became a drinksmith? That was our first encounter with Siobhan. You don't have the heart to leave her, do you? Now, please listen to my question. You think we should return to the Sweet Dreams troop? The so-called normal life is nothing more than just slavery for us. To us, abnormality means freedom. But you've lost something else. Ooh. The nacho cheese sauce. No, it's so good. Oh, do you want to leave Xiopan? You don't want to leave Xiopan. Let me help him make his final decision. You don't want to leave her. You've found the ultimate answer. What's even more important than freedom is companionship. Have you been waiting for me here for a while? Originally, reaching this room would have been impossible because the room cart was lost. But someone helped you and helped us out. Even without the room cart, you managed to open the door. We love Xiopan. I know I love her too. It's time to leave. This thought experiment has come to fruition. Oh, man. That's so sad. Diving is t into this dream is much more tiring than a fight. I agree. Xiopan was right. Now I admit that you're an extraordinary drinksmith. You're a perfect fit for Dream Jolt Holstery. Holstery. On behalf of all the members, welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Aboard, whatever. Thank you for what you've done. I'll drop by next time. Thank you for everything. Now that I've resolved all the monsters' problems, it's time to investigate Japan. Oh, it's a good photo. That's nice. Aww. 
Oh, damn. So do we find out the secrets of Siopan? Yay, we reached the final level! Okay, we have one last one, which is the final one. Okay... We also have the character uh, selection screen, but like, we're not gonna select a character yet. Let's go to contact Mr. Pickwick. Let's see. Woof, you got some time now? You promised to meet up. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna go. See you at the bar. Let's go, sir. We're gonna go find Chopin. We're going to find out her secret. Woof, there you are. I've been waiting for you. I told her that we wouldn't be at the lounge today. Now we can do whatever we want. Sounds great. What's your plan? No worries. So the doggo will always be your most reliable partner. Although I've never left the hotel, my handsome and keen nose will lead us straight to Siopan. Woof. Woof! I hear that golden hour is huge and crowded, so stick close and don't get lost. Okay, let's go. Uh... Go, go, go! We need to find Chopin. Why is Sparkle there? Oh, oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sparkle, guys, it's Sparkle. Hey, guys. Walking your dog, huh? He looks so happy. <laughs> you know, I think he's the one taking you for a walk. Have we met somewhere? Huh? Nah, I don't think so. I look like a lot of people, so you must be mistaking me for someone else. Woof, we've got something super important to do. Yeah, yeah, talking duck, so cute. I'll bring you a gift next time, but for now, I've got work to do, so I'm out of here. Bye bye. Oh, 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 black swan? Oof, so that's clocky. This place is so spacious, perfect for a gleam of float disc. Oh, I almost forget. Let, let's find Siopan first. Oof, so many scents mixed up here. Are you looking for me? Chill out. Just kidding. You seem a little troubled. How about I draw a fortune card for you? What does that mean? Just doing you a favor and returning the favor. Well, it's done. Woof, I've got Japan scent. Let's go. Now go. Seize the opportunity before it slips away. It still feels like a fever dream, you know? We follow. I'm gonna yank this thing out first. Oh. We got the port. Yay, we got oat cake rolls. Woof! Look, it's Japan! And the person next to her? I think I've met her before. Hey, it's the bad guy who tried to take Siopan away from the lounge. How did they end up together? Woof woof! I'll drag Siopan back. Hold up, not so fast. Woof! Then let's sneak over and eavesdrop on their conversation. <sighs> let's listen. It's Amiki. As I said, staying at the random rundown lounge is a total waste of your talent. If you had just listened to me earlier, you wouldn't be in this mess. Lucky for you, the family head is in a good mood, so I'll take you to see her. Just be careful with what you say. Don't worry. You haven't forgotten who taught you the basics of acting, have you? I will be careful. Hm, good to know. And don't spend all day obsessing over those monsters of yours. I'll handle them. Now let's get going. Oh. Are you okay? 
let's let's head back. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. He seems extra upset. Hmm. Is there anything I'm missing here? Oh, 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 I will love this one. Thank you. Thank you. Collecting. Hopefully I haven't missed out anything around here. Yeah, I think we visited this like yesterday or something. Back to the lounge, baby! Back to the lounge. Okay, we have... Uh, we gotta go. Gotta go. Talk to this bunch. Hey, you're back! I was so worried about you guys! Woof! Xiaopan, she doesn't want us anymore! <laughs> what nonsense are you talking about, silly dog? You think you can fool us? With that pathetic tiny brain of yours? Woof! I'm telling the truth! The drinks miss saw it too! Xiaopan, she left with the bad guy who showed up at the lounge last time! She doesn't want to stay here anymore! Oh my god, lies, nothing but lies. Truth has never existed from the beginning. Is that true? Don't just stand there, there are troublemakers out there everywhere. Oh? Watch out, these monsters are feral and aggressive. Don't let your guard down. They won't hurt anyone. What the heck? Why is there a human in this hellhole? Oh, shut up. You're so rude. We've been ordered to wipe out all the monsters in the hotel in the dreamscape. Let's just do our job. Woof! This is our lounge. We won't let any baddies do anything bad. No time to ex explain. I have, I've got to stop them first. Fight, fight, fight. Fight, fight, fight. Okay, let's just go first. Shut up. Shoo! <laughs> Combat is always fun. Let's just beat you up. Oh no! He's gonna do that blast thing. Let's go. Let's see. Oh shit. Enhance you. Okay, we're gonna go for this. Okay, first off, let's just go for this one. Hmm. Please give us the damn shield now. Please, 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 I beg you. Hey, that's so rude! He stole it! That's so rude. That is so rude. He stole the energy. 
铁魂奔涌。What even is the point at this point? <laughs> we don't need a shield. Let's go. We did it. We did it. No way. This gray hair is way too tough. Hey, what the heck are you doing? You're helping those monsters fight against us. Are you nuts? Everyone calm down. Are you kidding me? Stop talking nonsense. Dream Joke Troop is just a bunch of monsters. They roam around and attack people and many guests have been attacked. And now you're saying they're safe? No one will believe that nonsense. Moreover, they're just animated objects to entertain guests. They can be easily replaced. Is it really worth all this trouble to protect them? No, they're not just objects. Enough with your naive kindness. Can you take responsibility if someone gets hurt because of those monsters? I thought no one can get hurt in a dream scheme, hmm? What's more, they're corrupted by the nightmare. Even if they seem harmless now, they'll show their true colors at the slightest provocation. Monsters are monsters beyond redemption. No need of shield if we can beat them immediately. I'm not at that stage yet, though, lol. I'll give you one last chance to think it over. After leaving a few harsh words, the Bloodhound family members take their leave for now. You can clearly hear slopping from behind you. No. What's going on here? Those hounds. They've been here? I'll contact the head of the Bloodhound family right away. That's not the most urgent problem now, Xiopan. You should check on them first. They... They wanted to capture all of us, and they said... They were just a bunch of worthless trash. What should we do? <laughs> it's so scary. They'll lock us in and lash us like hell. Despair is clutching at my heart. So stifling. I'm about to suffocate. It's too much to handle. They said mean things and even hurt Tin Man. I'll fight those scoundrels no matter what. Wolf, Xiopan, are you gonna abandon us? That's why you sent those baddies to get rid of us, right? What nonsense are you even talking about? I never wanted to abandon you guys. But I heard it all, Wolf. I heard everything you guys talked about. You want to go back to the family and continue your former career. We're nothing but unruly monsters, just a burden to you. Wolf, we can't do anything useful. We bicker all day long and we may lose control anytime. So you have to stay in this lounge forever. That's why you hired a new drinksmith. You've been thinking about leaving for a while now. No, I hired... I hired a mirror because... Their emotions are too intense to be calmed down by words. If we don't handle it well, they might go into a frenzy again. What's wrong? You used to be so articulate. But when it really matters, why don't you say anything? Is it because you're afraid of saying the wrong thing and making them even angrier? Amiki, just shut up. Hmm? Don't think you can order me around. I'm not listening. Back then, there was a fool who gave up her acting career to become a drinksmith and she always said with confidence that drinksmith is an art of communication. Now that you're a drinksmith, why don't you solve the problem the best way you know how? Could you please make me a drink now, Miri? I'm happy to help. Let's go. Make me your best drink, or one that you think suits me best right now. We've known each other for quite a while now. So what do you think is the drink that fits me best? I'm looking forward to your answer. Oh my gosh, this is this is so hard. Uh that best suits me. Mm. Now, first of all, you need to calm, calm thy titties. Uh, hmm. 
I don't know what to make though. I think something that is sweet and intense will be good for you right about now. Wait, what does she like? Sweats. Hmm... Jamal, this is gonna be really funny, but like... I'm gonna have us... one and we're going to have something nice hmm what if we go for this I think this time. Mm. Yeah, intense. Everything intense, okay? Everything intense. I think you're someone who feels very intensely so i'm gonna like very sweet very strong very thick everything very everything okay everything heh <sighs> what's an intriguing flavor time is limited so i'll be straightforward i removed the protection for my heart during this time please use your powers to let everyone know how I'm really feeling. I won't hide anything anymore. You'll all see the real me. The genuine me. I'm ready. Let's go. Okay. Let's go, baby. I'm going to have a snack, so I may not be speaking much. new radio at the store. Want it? You're always saying the lounge is cold and lonely, right? Well, check this out. It really does the trick. Try listening to the radio when you're bored. The programs from the Iris family won't leave you bored. Wolf, thank you. I'll cherish it. By the way, you've been staying in this lounge for quite a while. It's about time I give you a name. Since you enjoy listening to the radio so much, why don't we call you... Oh, I've got something interesting in mind. Woof, what's that? From now on, your name is Mr. Bigwig. Woof, my name is Mr. Bigwig. An awesome name. I love it. Reporting to Mr. Bigwig. Recently, the family sealed off the hotel in the dreamscape. I'm planning to explore its depths again and see if there are any other sweet dreams troop members who have been abandoned like you. Requesting your instructions. Woof, let's go. Yeah, let's go. That's right. Although I want to open a lounge, I'm still lacking a fair few things now that I look at it. How can a proper upscale lounge be empty? I'll have to see what I can do. Hmm. Oh, his jigsaw fragment. Mm hmm. Hmm.
was this terrible place. I woke up and found myself here with nobody but <laughs> monsters. What bad luck? Oh, this is terrible. Oh, I need a bathroom when I'm nervous. But where is it? Wolf, it's my peer, Mr. Dice. 4 plus 2 minus 3. Is the result big or small? Big. It's big. 5 times 4 minus 2 and then divided by 6. Is the result big or small? Small. It's small. 8 squared divided by 4 minus 4 and then divided by 4. Is the result big or small? I, I have a tummy ache. A, a little tummy ache. I need to use the bathroom. Wolf, these questions are just too hard. It's natural. If you can't handle these questions, small size Sweet Dreams troop members don't have good computation abilities. I ask it those questions just to see if it's becoming combat combative. And luckily, it seems like the nightmare corruption on it is still not too deep. Would you come back with me if you don't mind? Come back? But where? I've opened a lounge in the depths of the hotel in the dreamscape for those abandoned. Sweet Dreams troop members like you. There, you won't have to work. Just live happily. The only rule is, no fighting. Will you join us? It could be dangerous for you to stay in this sealed hotel all alone, and you'll feel lonely without any company. But if you join us, you'll have a family. Family? Then, can, can I take bathroom breaks whenever I want? <laughs> of course you can! You can do whatever you want without any restrictions, and there won't be any bullying in the name of discipline. I won't allow what happened before to happen again. Follow up if you're interested. It's time to go home. Aww. Okay, go have a nap. Oh, coma is always terrible. Oh man, I would really want something if nacho cheese like right about now. Mm. Wolf, we've got a new partner, Shopan. Let's give Mr. Dice a name too. <laughs> I want the coolest name we can think of. The kind that scares people just by hearing it. Well, I was terrible at naming characters when I wrote scripts. I see you have some spades on your dice, so maybe I'll just call you Spade? Whoa, that's so casual. Woof, I think it's a great name. It suits you. What? How does it suit me? You... You silly... Silly dog. Yeah, <laughs> silly dog. Hey, stop. No fighting here. If you're so energetic, come help me set up the lounge. Oh, we finished the jigsaw. The design is sophisticated and it fits well with the overall atmosphere. Finally, it's starting to look like a lounge. But there's still something missing. Something just doesn't feel right. Woof, it's because there are no customers yet. It would feel more like a lounge if it were filled with customers. Wait, hee hee, my kind of counter is so clean. It has to be piled with paper money and chips to bring out the vibes. Ah, I get it. I forgot to prepare the ingredients for mixing the drink. Hmm. I can understand it now. I'm currently watching the process of Siopan meeting with the monsters and building the lounge together. Okay. Is it time to jump to the next memory? Boing. Boing. If you're planning to keep hanging out in this shabby lounge and play house with those monsters, don't blame the Iris family for not saving a spot for you. Seriously, you... You're not taking your future seriously enough. The status within the family, the superficial flowers and applauses, what can I do with any of that? You're the one who's gotten too caught up in it, Amiki. Let's go, Mr. Bigwig. Woof! After completing the jigsaw, the timeline of the memory advances. Siopan still plans to stay here and continue searching for the abandoned Sweet Dreams troop deeper in the hotel in the dreamscape. Hmm, I see. 
Du, 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 du. We have to keep going down, 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 down. Excuse me. Sweet dreams are as fickle as fantasy filled soap bubbles. Ha! Love stems from lies and passion arises from ignorance. Are you here just to bully me? Not at all. Xiaopan wants to help you. You were part of the sweet dreams troop, weren't you? Did the family abandon you in the dreamscape? I have always been on my lonesome. If the expectation were never envisaged, how would one be considered abandoned? Please speak like a normal person. I'll set up a lounge nearby where no one will bully you. There you can meet others from the Sweet Dreams troop who are in the same situation as you. Will you come with me? Are you sure no one will bully me there? Yes, I won't allow it, at least. Do I still need to participate in plays and act out roles? No, you don't. Or perhaps you can, if you're interested. Are you really... really sure no one will bully me? Are you actually expecting a yes from me? I'm leaving. Do you want to come with me or not? Take me with you! Okay, so we go back to the lounge. There was a lounge here. Wolf, this is the first time a monster actively shows up here. Yeah, I'm the owner of this lounge. Judging by your appearance, it seems like the nightmare hasn't affected you, right? At least my mind has been unclouded so far. Tell me, what's your purpose in bringing back these abandoned monsters? It's none of your business, is it? Now that you've managed to avoid the impact of the collapsing dreamscape, leave and find a safe place. Then why are you stay why are you still staying at the dreamscape yourself? I have unfinished business. Listen, even if you're not showing signs of frenzy now, as part of the Sweet Dreams troop, the nightmare will eventually corrupt you. So leave now and find a safe place while you still have your sanity. But similarly, as long as someone's part of the Sweet Dreams troop, there's no actual safe place for them. Show me your lounge. I mean, sure, why not? Wolf, we're back! <laughs> Some new friends! Alright, listen up. In this lounge, you all do what I say. Whenever I give an order, you follow it. Got it? Now, if you understand, be a good troop member and... Clean the toilets. What do you say? <sighs> I knew someone would bully me in the end. Stop your nonsense. Relax, there are no such rules in this lounge. Oh, I need to give you guys names. How about... I just call you melancholy. <sighs> that name doesn't really fit me. I mean, I'm not melancholic at all and I'm not poetic at all. Besides, melancholy encompasses more than just an emotion. It's an attitude towards the world. Woof, you really should hear what you just said. That name suits you perfectly. Hee <laughs> hee, perhaps this is what those customers call yuppies? <laughs> Y-U-P-P-I-E? Is that how it's spelled? It's your turn now. Let me see... Wait, I already have a name. It's Starlet. Woof? I... I don't even know what to say, my friend. <laughs> Come on, big guy. Are you seriously called... Starlet? What kind of quirky style is that? <laughs> Show some respect. Don't make fun of people's names. Sorry, I didn't mean to poke fun, but it's just hilarious. <laughs> Starlet, do you twinkle, Starlet? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. <laughs> hey, now you won't like to see me mad. Urgh. All right, let's get back to setting up the lounge. With new members on board, we'll finish it up in no time. I need your help, Melancholy and... Darla. <laughs> hey! <sighs> okay, let's go and do the jigsaw. Okay, let's go. We are like. <laughs> the 
I've got everything I need. Don't I look like a drink smith when I stand behind the counter? Woof! Our lounge is all set and ready to roll. It looks so awesome and grand. Hehehe, <laughs> finally a place to call home for a good while. I'm so touched. Ah, there's truly no place like home in the world. Have you thought about our next steps? If they stay here, they'll eventually go berserk. What will you do then? I'll figure something out. Maybe there's no permanent solution. But at least... They can have a happy life like this. When the Sweet Dreams troop gets corrupted by co my negative emotions, they turn into the Dream Jolt troop and end up being pursued by the family. They've got nowhere to go except the sealed hotel in Dreamscape. Aw, hi Chikage, welcome to the sheepdom. Welcome. Will they stay in this hotel until they're wiped out? That won't happen to them. Not under my watch. I promise you. The lounge is all decorated, but Lady and the Tin Man haven't appeared. Ooh, it's gonna take a while more, guys! The dreamscape is collapsing, and there aren't many Sweet Dreams troop members who can keep their sanity. Come on, let's go deeper into the area. Oof, Xiopan, you sound tired. Xiopan does look exhausted. I should be nearing the end soon. Oh... So there's some more members here. I still think Penacony is like pretty uh, complicated to me. Gah! That's scary. I don't want to date you people. Leave me alone. Go away. Well, if I'm not some berserk monster, relax and listen. It's okay now. He won't hurt you. Just take a breath. Open your eyes and see, I'm not a monster, just an ordinary human being. And a handsome dog, woof! Oh, oh, you see, I got lost in this maze-like place and couldn't find my way out. Could you please show me the way? Sure thing, come with me. Have you redeemed the code yet? Have I reached the code redemption? I need to like... Oh yeah, I can redeem it. I can redeem it. Thank you. <gasps> I got soon I will reach five guys. Soon I will reach like uh five streaming days. <laughs> soon I will reach like there are four codes released recently. Wait, really? Really? I don't know if I have gotten them yet, but I will see them at some point. Yeah. I thought you meant for like the stream incentive. Because we're really, really close to like 5 days, I think. Yeah, we're really close to like 5 days. Oh, is that so? Thank you so much. I, have I gotten the more peach one? Yeah, thank you for the codes. Thank you, thank you. Well, if you're talking in a weird way just like those guests do. Well, I used to be a superstar entertaining those guests. I've been on some amazing stages. Superstar? Heh, <laughs> it's been a while since I heard that word. Do you enjoy being on stage? Yeah, for sure! Being loved by so many guests and shining on the stage is a true blessing. Going to like save those quotes somewhere first or like... Uh... Wait, yeah. Thank you. A true blessing, right? If you like the stage so much, I'll just call you Superstar. Oof, but we already have a starlet! Oh, right, let me think again. Can I... call myself Lady? I've always envied those guests in fabulous clothes. They're so elegant. Enjoy the game, alright? Thank you, Chikage. I'll enjoy it. Thank you for dropping by with the codes. I appreciate it. Sure, you can call yourself whatever you want. So, shall we head home? Thank you. I'll be right behind you. Okay, let's go, baby. Uh, return to the launch. Do we have to keep doing this? We probably do. It's okay, we're nearing the end, guys. We're nearing the end. I'm surprised I haven't lost my voice yet, but I suppose... Uh, it, it just be what it be. Call 
call your administrator. What do you mean it's temporarily closed to the public? Is that how you treat your customers? Do you even have a smidgen of respect for your customers? Basic etiquette. Woof, there's the frenzy monster in the lounge. That's scary. Did they just say that the lounge is totally safe? No, it's not frenzy. That Sweet Dreams troop member is just grumpy. What would you like? A drink, of course. Are you the drinksmith here? Fetch me something. I'm dying of thirst. Sure. I can make you whatever you want. Oh, this is when Xiu Huan meet all the monsters of family. Right? No. I want a drink that's slightly sour, not too bitter, super sweet, refreshing, fruity, and with a little fizz. Hurry up. Woof, I don't think we have all those ingredients. What? How dare you open a lounge without decent ingredients? What a joke. You can't even whip up a decent drink. I'm leaving. Hold on. I'm not waiting any longer. Well, I'll make you the drink you want. Just give me a moment. Here you go. Exactly what you asked for. Don't get ahead of yourself. I've met plenty of people like you. All high and mighty, thinking they rule the world. But guess what? They all end up bowing before me. Fine, I'll give it a try. If it doesn't impress me, your lounge will have to shut down. Cool. Uh, what's happening? Here, my head feels a bit dizzy, like I've had a strong drink, but somehow I'm feeling calm. Hey there, nice to meet you all. Greetings, my lady. You're absolutely stunning. Would you mind if I... Yeah, I'm not interested in you at all. You're truly a miracle worker, Xiopan. What did you do? It was just a little experiment. I added some special ingredients that help calm him down. Seems like it worked pretty well on our grumpy customer, though maybe I added a bit too much. Say, uh, hey, hello, mister? Oh, hey, did you call me? I'm in a wonderful mood right now. If you need anything, just feel free to ask and I'll seriously consider it. So from now on, uh, you'll be a regular at this lounge and I'll make sure to serve you delicious drinks. Sound good? Oh, and you need a name. Oh, this is giving me a headache. I'll just pick one from the show I used to act in. Let's go with Tin Man. It suits a big guy like you, a bit tactless and all. Alright, that settles it. Is that my name now? Yeah, that's your name. Don't forget it because that's what all the monsters and I will call you at the lounge. Because names, you know, they form our initial bond. Oh, I see. Finally, we're going to... Oh my gosh, it's a special gift! I'm not gonna read it. Let's go! Right, newly minted jeans with... Eh? The version of Siopan here can actually see me? Don't make a fuss, go. <gasps> we are going to piece together the puzzle. Let's go. The final puzzle, people. Is it this one? <gasps> Time to celebrate the grand opening of our lounge! Yeah, it's the grand opening. But I don't think there'll be any other customers coming here except for you guys. Woof, even so, it's still worth celebrating. When I first arrived, there was practically nothing. Now everything is set up, and we've made so many friends! From now on, this lounge will be called Dream Jolt Whole Story. It's a place for all who can't enjoy sweet dreams. We're not accepted by the outside world, so we've gathered here. We are... each other's sweet dreams. Don't get me fusy like that, Japan. No. Looks like you're quite used to peering into people's hearts, right? Honestly, revealing all of my innermost feelings. Ha. <sighs> it feels pretty bad. It makes you feel vulnerable. I'm not quite schooled at it, though. Well, we can pick and choose right now. Let's keep going. I haven't finished my drink yet. I'm an orphan, and I never knew who my parents were. I was abandoned at the Reverie Hotel before I was old enough to remember anything. 
Maven, head of the Iris family, adopted me and raised me as a future star. I once achieved great success in my acting career, but in the end, the stage wasn't for me. I just couldn't fit in. Life under the spotlight was too much for me. I despised being in front of the camera, the never-ending interviews, and the mind-numbingly boring scripts. I'd rather be with those monsters than in a rowdy crowd. I long for a real family. A real family? Like the Sweet Dreams troupe? Yeah, they're simple and innocent kids. Being with them brings me peace and happiness. That's why I can't stand those who treat them as tools and boss them around. Unfortunately, there are too many selfish and hypocritical people in the dreamscape, bullying the weak to boost their own pathetic egos. So, I left the stage because I wanted to help them. You know what happened next? The dreamscape started collapsing and the hotel got sealed by the family and became a spot infested by frenzied monsters. I stay here, searching for the abandoned Sweet Dreams troop members who are still sane. I established this lounge, making drinks for those monsters and finding ways to calm them down, hoping to change their fate. They're my most important family, and I don't want to see them get hurt. Hi Kenji, hello! Good morning. It's time to face reality. Oof, I'm so sorry, Stupan. We shouldn't have doubted you. You've done so much for us. I'm sorry. I haven't been spending much time in the lounge lately, and I haven't had a chance to explain everything to you guys. The reason I entrusted this lounge to Miri for now is that I heard about the family's plan to eliminate all monsters in the hotel in the dreamscape. To stop them, I need to regain the support of the Iris family. Mixing drinks? It's like having a conversation, but I couldn't do it well on my own. Look at you now, Siopan! What happened to the boldness you had when you confronted the whole, the entire Iris family? Remember when you came to me all excited and said, Hey, Anaki, I found a dog and it wants to come home with me. Now that you've decided to run this lounge, take responsibility for it. Did I ever say I was running away, Amiki? Well, you've become quite the lecturer, haven't you? I'm happy to see you've grown more mature. Hey, don't try to change the subject. Let's go. We'll go meet those hounds. Are we gonna do another fight? Two more? Don't get in our way. Whoever you are, don't think you can stop the Bloodhound family. Oh? You really don't care who we are? Being too reckless would get you into trouble. Don't threaten me. A bloodhound's a bloodhound family member's will is resolute as steel. I don't mean to intimidate, but perhaps you could do the Iris family a favor. This lady, Amaki, is the favorite daughter of Lady Maven, head of the Iris family, and she's now a superstar in the dreamscape. Are you willing to listen to what I have to say for her sake? Hey, you talk as if you're not a core member of the Iris family. Do you really see yourself as just a random drinksmith? These monsters aren't aggressive at all. As you can see, a little scare is enough to frighten them. They won't pose a threat to the guests' safety. What's more, Yuri's recent actions have proven that they can be controlled. Yeah, I can prove that. Even the Dream Dolt troop, corrupted by the nightmare, can live in harmony with us. Those who are interested in those monsters and have visited the lounge will tell you the same thing. If you don't believe me, why don't you ask around? And if you're truly interested, I can ask our family head to speak with you guys, and I'm pretty sure her words will be more convincing, don't you think? Uh. Are you members of the Dream Dolt troop who came here with them? Hmm? It feels terrible to be treated like lifeless objects and bossed around, doesn't it? Well, you always have the choice to leave. You don't have to spend your life obeying their orders. All new members are welcome at Dream Jolt Whole Story. <laughs> He's trying to convert. Lol. What's happening? The monsters are running away? Are they affected by the nightmare and going frenzy? How are we supposed to carry out this task without them? They didn't become frenzy. They simply don't want to follow orders anymore. They've realized that they have options other than being mere tools for their family. 
Why are you still here? Do you want me to say hi to your boss? No, of course not. We'll leave right now. Sorry for the disturbance. Well, I chose to stay in the desolate hotel in the dreamscape to stay away from family issues. But in the end, I had to rely on my family connection to protect this lounge. That's why your idealism can't solve any problems. So stop being naive and be more realistic. Besides, you will fulfill what you promised me, right? Right? Don't worry. Have I ever lied to you? We'll discuss the business once we've taken care of everything in the lounge. Woof, but... Chopin? Those guys were right. We'll be corrupted by the nightmare one day, right? Yeah. Nothing will change. I can't help get rid of the nightmare completely. I'm sorry. Woof, I didn't mean to blame you. Just like humans can get sick, members of the Sweet Dreams troop can be affected by negative emotions and become frenzied. Life is a process of constant change, and there's no permanent solution. Problems will always arise, and we'll keep solving them moment by moment. But, no matter how much you all flip out there, I will stay here and help you find yourself. You gotta take this screenshot, she's so pretty. In my eyes, you're no different from me. I'll stay with you forever until the dreamscape collapses completely. Oof, thank you. And... Even if I'm gone one day, there's someone else who's willing to treat you all like family, right? Don't you agree, New Drink Smith? Uh, uh, me? me? Aww, that's so sad. Shopan, this is not what we agreed on. Wolf, you're starting to talk like me now. We agreed that I'll help you restore your relationship with the Iris family and keep this lounge. In return, you promised me to come back to the stage and to perform together with me. But why? Why are all the monster names listed on this promotional poster? Ace Dealer, Spade, Melancholy Dramatist, Soda, Big Wig, Lady and Justice, Steel Tin Man, and Starlet the Philosopher King. Your name isn't there! <laughs> Are you underestimating our performance skills, dear lady? Come to my show and you won't be disappointed. What we agreed on was that the owners of Dream Joel Hostelry will assist the fam Iris family in their performances. Since this lounge belongs to this lounge belongs to those monsters, they will be participating in the show. Is that a problem? F even decided to become an idol to save our lounge from closing down. Oh no, this is love life. Oh god. You, you're being sly. Hm. I've contacted the Bloodhound family and they've agreed to postpone the cleanup of the hotel in the dreamscape. In other words, these monsters will be safe and Dream Jolt Hostelry will continue to operate. Thank you for everything. If it weren't for you taking over as a drinksmith, I wouldn't have had time to deal with all the troubles within the family. Thank you. We really appreciate your help. Don't mention it. Ah, she's so sweet. <gasps> now go make yourself an exclusive drink as a souvenir of your drinksmith career. <gasps> I get to make one for myself. <gasps> Let's go. Uh... I'm gonna make a very thick drink, so like... Let's see... Uh... What if I do... What if I stir like this? Hmm... I want something sweet and pink. Hmm. I'm just, I'm just winging it, guys. I'm winging it, okay? I don't know what I'm doing. 
Mm. We could have this. I'm so glad. I really like this combination though. Hmm. What if I stir this? That is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Um. Okay, how about we go with a large white glass? More ice, uh, yeah. Okay, we'll go with this. Um, I do like the pinks. What if I do this? I don't know what I'm doing, by the way. I'm just kind of like winging it. Pepper sheep football, yay! See, sweet, intense, and thick. Let's go. This drink will be made specially for you. I will add it to the Dream Joe Hostelry's drink menu. Customers will get to taste it, so you better consider your choice carefully. <gasps> I'm so stressed. No. Sweet, strong, and thick. I am an intense person, okay? Let me think. You know what? Let's, let's try again. Let's try again. Um. Let's try something that looks a bit more like me, okay? Um. Let's see. We do want some green, right? Some blossom dew. Let's stir this. Nah, dream jam. Hmm. Stir. Oh god, that's kind of ugly. What if I stir this one? This is pretty. I like it. Mm, or should I go like this? Stir. Mm hmm. And then maybe pink like that. Pink like this. And then an orange on top. <gasps> Guys, does this represent me? <laughs> does this represent me? <laughs> you know what? Maybe I should like restart. Just does something. Uh, restart. I want to get a big one now. Uh, let's go. Try put down my new banner. I already have Archer on. Or save up. I mean, what, uh, whatever you wish. Whatever you wish. Whatever you wish. Honestly, you shouldn't ask me something like that. Yeah. But, uh... I mean, if you already have what you want, then don't... Don't, you know, uh...
Hmm, I like this. And then we have the final touch. <gasps> this is me! This is me! Guys, isn't it me? Is it not me? I don't like that. Or should I make the bottom? Should I make it all just fill blood energy? Let's try again. What if I do this? Oh my gosh, it's intense. Okay, then I will have like... Offer goat milk. And then I will have like... Uh, Should I just put pink? Nah, nah. Like that. Like that. Put for goat milk. Uh, pink, like that. And then... Finally, dream jam. I think this suits me a lot more, don't you think? <laughs> This suits me a lot more. Look at my avatar and look at me now. <laughs> e yes, yeah, let's go with this. Yeah, it's so nice. Okay, I mean, it's thick and it's sweet and it's not intense, but like. Then the. It didn't. The I was going to put a catch your stream just so you hope you're doing good. I am doing great, but we're, we're gonna like end soon because I'm gonna pass away. If I'm not careful. Let's go with... Should we go with a mint or... A, lem or a lemon, guys. Lemon or mint? Very thick, very sweet. It's ready to stick. They all look good. Lemon? You know what? I think I go with some. Like, really? You want mint? Okay, mint it is. Mint. Very nice. Very sweet. Very thick. Can I please like... Very sweet. Very thick. This is so funny. <laughs> very sweet. Very thick. Very nice. Is the mixing done? I'll pick this one. Mint is it? Okay, mint it is, yeah. An interesting thought. Looks like Gallagher was right. It's always a surprise if you're around. This special drink that belongs to you will be kept on the Dream Jolt Whole Story drink menu to commemorate those who will forever be your friends. You're always welcome, amazing drink smith of Penacone. <gasps> ah, yeah, baby. And we are done! Finally! Let's look at the... Okay, so let's... Go have and got enough to come back and serve more customers. Oh, we can just keep going. That's fun. Claim. I claim, guys. Resin! 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 That's so generous of them. I now have three resin. I almost have enough to make like a full uh, set of like relics, I think. Yay! And then we have the character selection, but I'm gonna do this some other time because I'm I'm gonna perish soon. I'm actually gonna uh, perish soon. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So guys, I think it's time to like end because you see, uh, I think I might actually perish. Uh, yeah, I might actually perish soon. So, <laughs> yeah, alright. Wish you a good rest, yeah. Okay, so those of you on YouTube, thank you for sticking around. Okay, thank you for watching. Those of you on uh, Twitch, please stay with me. I'll send you guys off to someone else, okay? And then I will see you guys uh, for a stream probably like tomorrow. And then we'll be doing way more interesting things, I swear, okay? More interesting things than making uh, drinks, for sure, yeah. Okay. Bartender event! We finished day one! Go! Let's go! Welcome to the Sheep Dan Kenji! Welcome! Welcome! Yay! Okay! Adiari! Adiari! Wait, let me just like uh, put the raid message here. 
Hi, so funny, man. Thank you very much. If you like to follow me on my stream next time, you can like uh, press follow on my Twitter, not Twitter, my Twitch. If not, yeah, I'll see you when I see you. Okay, I'll see you. I'll see you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.